Wow! Amazing timing on that. Hi! Hello, Bob! Thank you so much for the raid. Right as we're coming in, we literally just got done with the starting soon screen. Hi, everybody! Hello, hello, hello. I am back. Uh, we're gonna play some RE4 tonight. I don't know for how long. Um, because believe it or not, for just unspecific, um, indeterminate reasons, uh, it turns out I have actually been developing a headache, uh, today. <laughs> and it's, it's just started to hit me. Can't imagine where that possibly came from. On a related note, hey guys, uh, y'all seen this video called Subspace Dubbed Over? I guess it's 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 hilarious. Have you seen it? It's hilarious. I guess it's like a viral video where subspace dubs over. <laughs> it's hilarious. It's it's what subspace wanted to say at the time, but he couldn't say it. That's not a guy. It's subspace doing the dub. Did he just make a video to show off? No. <laughs> He was at 6 a.m. and has one view. Hi. Okay. No, in all seriousness, though, welcome. Um, yeah, so we did uh we did shadow drop a uh a, a, an April Fool's real-time fan dub today. If you weren't aware, um script is right there too. Oh, you're right. Oh, I gotta I maybe gotta change that now. I didn't think about the implications of actually doing a subspace emissary fandom because like the joke of this item on my fake desktop subspace emissary dub script is not that there's been a subspace emissary dub in the works for a long time um in fact it's been actually quite the opposite the joke is that i have been adamant for years that we were never going to do a subspace emissary fandom um but then april fools r rolled around and joy and i had this idea which was like, what if for April Fools we did subspace, but in the style of Bozo dubbed over? Which, if you don't know, is um is a sketch that we love from uh, the show I Think You Should Leave on Netflix. Um, and I could maybe show you the sketch for those who haven't had a chance to watch it. Um, it'll add context to what exactly was fucking going on with that uh fan dub today if you haven't seen it yes so we did put out an april fool's fan dub um of subspace emissary and i initially branded it as you know subspace emissary snap cubes real time fan dub in the title um and then in the thumbnail of course it was uh it was real time fan dub brawl was the title because we always have like some kind of weird subtitle that's the more official title um if you look at the branding now of course it has been rebranded to subspace dubbed over because that was kind of the um the secret title the whole time uh that was kind of the plan so it's still it's still a subspace dub but it's not subspace emissary real-time fandom it's subspace dubbed over because the whole joke is that it is intentionally the most like unfunny crass oppressive fan dub we've ever created so much so that it completely loops back around to being worth watching just for the spectacle of how insane it is and how just like because honestly my favorite thing is that you know watching it now i'm like wow this feels like this feels like 2008 <laughs> like the, like we really tried to capture that energy in a way and well more specifically we were trying to capture the spirit of bozo dubbed over um it was an awful experience i'd rewatch it 20 more times i am not going to lie to you i'm not going to lie to you <clears throat> i have created a sort of um a sort of a oh what's the term why why am i forgetting this uh a with the uh the where it's like you grow to love something that's like it, people uh people <laughs> a monster no that's not what i mean to say i've created um stockholm syndrome there it is yeah i've created a stockholm syndrome kind of relationship with this dub and i um where while recording it I was legit, like, it was so hard to get through. I, I mean, I was having a fantastic time. 
I I described it earlier on Twitter as one of the most fun recording sessions I have had in years and also one that I hope I never have to do anything even remotely similar to ever again. Because like it was literally like the version y'all see on YouTube is barely cut. That was the the audio experience entering my ears for like an hour straight, if not longer. Um, and so, you know, like at first I was like, wow, this is going to be hard to listen back to and like edit. But then I'm not kidding. The moment I finished the edit and actually uploaded the final version, um, I started over this past week, I just started kind of like listening to it to like, I started first, I started skimming through it to find certain bits. And then at one point I was like, well, why don't I just watch the whole thing again? And I restarted it and I watched it all the way through. And I was like, I kind of liked it that time. <laughs> and then eventually, like the next day, I watched it all the way through again. And I'm not kidding. For the past couple of days, I have been putting on this fucking video casually, like in, in my headphones. I will literally, I'll, I'll put in my AirPods and, th and throw it up on my phone and just just play it while I'm doing something. And I'm like, what the hell is wrong with me? <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, this was literally like to the point where to the point where I'm not kidding, I intentionally over compressed everyone's audio so much to the point like like to the point where I would never apply these compression settings to. OK, so let me hear. So this was like this is an example of the kind of compression i was putting on people's voices if you know anything about audio engineering you know that this is what you're looking at is insane let me try to explain it to you for those who don't understand so a compressor when you put it on audio when you put it on someone's voice it basically a compressor takes the loud parts of someone's audio and pushes it down so it's quieter and then it takes the quiet parts of someone's audio and it pushes it up so it's more level with the latter part. So basically, the more you compress something, the more even it's going to sound. But then the more you're going to get that kind of like that boomy kind of like radio voice kind of feel where everything is extremely level, but also you don't get as much like dynamics. Right. So that threshold setting at the top here, here, let me actually let me <laughs> do a little bit of a diagram. So right here we have a threshold setting, which is basically saying Anything that is above a certain audio level, a certain decibel level, I want you to compress that down. So basically, any noise for the audio that is over negative 34 decibels, which is basically inaudible from like a voice standpoint. I don't actually know if that's true. It's really quiet, right? So it that's basically like all of someone's like, speech like like speech like speech volume and especially with how loud everyone was acting in the dub this is basically everything so this is like okay take every noise and make it quieter and then ratio um l plus is basically okay you so you want to make the louder stuff quieter how much quieter do you want to make it and so for example if if the ratio is one to one for example, that's saying, okay, or let's just say two to one. So basically that's saying, okay, everything that's over this threshold, we want to compress it. Like for every like decibel, we want to basically compress it like two decibels or, or whatever. Right. So it's like the higher ratio you have, the more it's like squeezing that audio together. Basically, the more it's just like pushing it down. Right. Um, and then you get through attack and release, which is basically just how fast you want the effect to apply. This is like basically as fast as possible, nearly. Um, so it's like on everything, essentially. And then output gain is, OK, you've made all of the loud parts quieter. How, how loud do you want to make the quiet parts? And I have the output gain set to plus 12 decibels, which is too much. <laughs> So basically, I, I know this is like kind of, again, I don't know how, how well I explain this if you're not into audio engineering at all, um, but basically, 
This is this is an insane compressor. This is like too much, basically. This is like to the point where everyone's like sniffles and coughs are almost equal volume level to them just talking normally and then screaming is compressed downwards so much that it just sounds like white noise essentially <laughs> like that and it, that was on purpose basically i like intentionally fucked up everyone's audio with the compressor just to just to further make it the most incomprehensible experience anyway i can't even remember why <laughs> started talking about the compressor but essentially it's insane to me that i started just listening to this casually because because i intentionally made it the most like insanely unparsable audio experience i could have possibly done while still keeping enough audibility that you'd get like some of the bits like um you know fan favorite wario i gotta win which uh was all holly by the way um, like, obviously she's the one who did it, but also she like 112% brought that idea to the table. We had like no idea what she was going to be doing with that. Um, we knew that there was one line that she was going to repeat. Like we knew she was going to come in and basically repeat a single line as Wario. Um... And I think actually earlier she had mentioned it was going to be Wario, I gotta win. Um, but we had forgotten by recording date. And then also we had no idea the way she was going to deliver it. Which, which is really just what brings it together. You know, saying Wario, I'm going to win is one thing. But the fucking power behind that first Wario. And then... Even further, the fucking power behind the second Wario when you realize that the cutscene restarted <laughs> and the slow dawning realization of the fact that we're about to hear <laughs> Wario again. Like, it's insane. It's so fucking funny. I hope y'all know that Wario got a one has become a stim for me. No, like, seriously, like, I genuinely all day today, I'm not kidding. I was like, Joy and I went to, because uh, by the way, I also swapped out um, my modem for a new modem. So hope, like we're fingers crossed, hoping that will help address some of the internet issues we've been having on stream recently. That's another story entirely. But like I was getting ready to go out to Micro Center to get to like pick up this modem. And I was like, I was trying to find a, like, a, like a top that I wanted to wear. And the whole time I'm just looking through my closet and I'm just saying, I'm sitting there like looking, like looking through the clothes and I'm just saying to myself, Wario. <laughs> like literally just quietly to myself, I gotta win. Like it's, it has been fucking locked in my brain ever since we recorded. Was the repeating cutscenes intentional? Not on our part, no. I had not fucking watched through the footage, like, at all before we started. <laughs> we specifically, we literally just, just pulled up a subspace emissary cutscene compilation. And it just turned out that, like, you know, because because everyone, like, didn't even think about the fact that, like, yeah, there are alternate versions of the same cutscenes in subspace, depending on which characters you play in the story mode. So... Like, when we got to that first repeat cutscene, you can hear Ryan, like, literally, hold on. Let me see if I can... This might, this might be a mistake, but let me pull this up really quick. Because you can hear Ryan go, Oh, God, no, it's, we gotta do it again. It's playing again because of the... Because the character, like, something like that, basically. Here. When, uh... <laughs> so, the thing explodes here let me let me pull up the display group really quick so the thing explodes <laughs> and then li literally right here as it starts to replay listen to ryan because you can hear the realization dawn <laughs> He goes, oh god, wait, it's happening twice because of the and then <laughs> And then fucking immediately 
immediately the second Wario hits like crazy. Oh my god, it's so fucking funny. I can't. I'm s like, I'm so happy. <laughs> the voice of a man realizing he's getting twice as much from Wario as he signed up for. No, it's so good, the progression of it. He, he like can't even finish his like plea for help. <laughs> Anyway, here you for the red. <laughs> oh my god. There's, yeah, there's so much to talk about. I'm just glad people are mostly responding to it. Like, obviously, okay, so the, y'all, the fucking 13 hours leading up to the premiere of this, when I, when I made the premiere page public at 12 a.m. today, Y'all have no clue just how much, like, preemptive damage control I was trying to do. Because here, because here's the thing, right? If this was just, like, because, like, you know, if we're going to do an April Fool's prank, I genuinely, I feel it truly in my heart. I want to make sure it's worthwhile in some way. Like, even if it's stupid, even if it's overwhelming, even if, like, even if some people don't like it, because I know some people don't fucking like this video already. And that's totally fair, right? Like, it's our worst video on purpose. Um, but, like, even if, even if people don't really like it that much, I still want those who are in on the joke kind of to have a good time with it, at least in concept, right? I want it to at least be something that isn't just like, oh, here's this thing you thought was happening, just kidding, it's not happening, go away. April Fools, fuck you, right? Like, I didn't wanna do that. Um, but also, it still needs to be like a prank, right? And so, if we wanted to just do the former, I could have just instantly premiered the video today at like 1 p.m. And it's like a Rick roll or something and everybody comes in like, oh, what the fuck? Like, you just started premiering the the subspace dub with no warning. Oh, my God. Oh, it's a Rick roll. OK, see ya. No, but like people, <laughs> people were. When we put the premiere page public 13 hours early. I specifically chose to make that page public at 12 a.m. today. And not any time yesterday or before, but not any time later today, specifically because I felt like that was the perfect time slot so that this video only exists in people's minds on April Fool's, right? So people know it's an April Fool's video in some way. Like, nobody knows about Subspace Dub on March 31st. The moment it's April 1st, what the fuck is this? Like, what's that? Like, what this video page just got posted. What is this, right? But also, we needed to post it early enough so that people would know and be expecting, okay, this is getting at least some lead in, like a few hours of lead in, probably so that I can make time to actually be at this premiere and watch it, right? Because if we just dropped it immediately, Who's to say we would have gotten nearly as many people there actually watching it for the first time? So we wanted there to be enough lead up that people could actually watch it when it came out. But also, we didn't want to put it up before April 1st because we wanted to have there be absolutely no illusions whatsoever that this was going to be like a standard dub. But then the problem that came with that is that I think that second part actually worked a little too well because... You know, of course, when the when the video first was like revealed before it actually premiered, when people saw the page and people saw the title, it was like, oh, it's April Fool's. Like, I, I, I fucking hate when people say they're going to do a cool thing and then they don't do it. And it's probably just going to be like a Rick roll. I got excited for two minutes, but then I remember the date. Like, I heard that so much. And so many people were like, oh, it's just going to be like all the cutscenes, And since nobody talks, it's going to be silent. Right. And it's like. I actually think I've joked about doing that specifically before, but it was like such a fucking crazy experience trying to like make sure people, as many people as possible knew, no guys, you have to understand 
this is a nearly hour long dub of subspace emissary and i was trying so hard to be like transparent enough about what it actually was that people would want to watch it and like give it a chance while also not saying so much that i'm not like explaining the joke ahead of time because i got so many like i saw so many comments that were like oh is it real or is it an april fool's joke when the reality is that it's both <laughs> and, and i didn't and i couldn't say that i couldn't i couldn't say like i couldn't say yes it's real but not the way you think it is right and that's that was the hard part is that i, I couldn't just say no guys you don't understand it's not that it's fake it's that it's real and that it's bad <laughs> like, that's the joke the joke is that it is the subspace emissary dub it is what it says on the tin but it's really, really fucking bad. And that is where the, the fool comes in, right? So I was trying so hard again to do like preemptive damage control with so many people who were like just instantaneously writing it off. And I was like, guys, please. I was like, please save your judgment. <laughs> I, I think I literally said that exactly so many times because I didn't want to give away the joke, but also, um, yeah, I think uh, I think it worked out. Many people seem to be on the same page, especially when I explained what the joke was after the fact, which is that it's not just that it's a bad subspace dub. It's that it's a bad subspace dub that is specifically meant to allude to a sketch that my friends and I have referenced so much already on like other Snapcube videos. So that like I knew for a fact at least a certain section of my audience was going to be familiar with what we were doing because we have referenced this same video so many times with just the whole like oh fuck what the fuck <laughs> or like the uh or like uh this guy's about to jack off like yeah it's so all of that is very specifically a reference to bozo dubbed over um which like have, have have any people in chat still not seen that? Are there any are there any people who still have no fucking clue what that is? Never heard of it till now. No, I haven't. Okay, I am going to show you. Okay, because even even if you enjoyed the dub for what it was, and even if you're like even if you realize it's supposed to be bad on purpose, and you get that part of the joke, right? I still need you to understand this came from a very specific place <laughs> and I would, and I would like you to understand. So actually this sketch that I'm going to show you actually exists in two parts. There's a first part to this, but you really only need to see the second part to kind of understand what we were going for. There is a whole first part that makes the overall sketch a little funnier and add some context to this bit in particular, but to understand the dub, here, this is all you need to see. That's the bit. Okay, now, now here's, now that you've seen it, if you're feeling adventurous and brave, I would, I would ask you now, or I would challenge you to watch it again and maybe see a little more, like, kind of where we were at with it. <laughs> because I think with the added context, you can maybe see why even the parts that like weren't as funny as like Wario I'm gonna win, I was still losing my shit the whole time. Like the first time Mar comes in as Kirby and the first thing he says is, oh fuck! And it's just like his like his normal screaming voice. It gets me. It gets me every time. It's so funny to me. Specifically with that context. Um I, I think genuinely, like, that's knowing that sketch, kind of being in the know on that kind of brings it together. But I think it is a testament to how well the idea worked out that most people seem to be enjoying it anyway, even just from the perspective of like, oh, OK, it's April Fool's. It's supposed to be bad. That's funny. Right. And then but even then it's like, OK, it's supposed to be bad. But also, why am I laughing? Which I think was kind of the the line we wanted to straddle with this one. Um, anyway, yeah, I'm gonna stop, <laughs> I'm gonna stop patting myself on the back. I just wanted to talk about it because there's, there's, I have a lot of feelings about it because um, 
it was cathartic, you know, it was cathartic to like someone on Tumblr asked me, they were like, it seemed like it was cathartic and it had me thinking like, yeah, you know what it was? It was really nice to just like, cause like y'all, we recorded this shit on Monday. <laughs> like <laughs> This was less than a week turnaround time for this fucking video and, and people love it. And it's like, it's already got like over 100k views and like, it's just, it was like literally zero effort on my part. Like zero. Um, and I don't really get the chance to do that with real time fandom anymore because like me personally, as like a creative person who, you know, real time fandom is like my tentpole project right now. It's like the thing that people really know me the most for. Like, I want to make sure that every new one is like the best one in a way, right? So having the chance to do something just like stupid again, like just so fucking dumb and like, again, no effort. It's barely cut. I cut out like a couple things here and there, um, but like only like a second's worth of stuff at a time. Um, yeah, I don't like it's just it's crazy. It, it's 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 a nice feeling that and honestly, you know. Hey, bonus dub. That's pretty cool. Like, I'm over here, like, fucking, like, <laughs> trying my best to think, like, oh, God, Kingdom Hearts is the next real one. Like, that. there's so much pressure behind that. It has to be good. Like, it's, an, it's a new series. It's a new, like, it's, it's the one that's been the most hype ever since, like, you know, since any of the Sonic ones. Like, Kingdom Hearts is kind of the, the next, like, biggest one, I feel like. So it's, like, you know... There's a lot behind that, and I, I have some ideas that I think people are going to be really excited about, and I know I'm excited about, but also, like, it's just a lot. It's a lot to think about, and I'm like, how is this even going to work? Because um, we don't even know if Kingdom Hearts is going to be, like, good for it, right? I haven't even finished putting, like, the footage together. It's it's crazy. Um, But, like, yeah. So, amidst all of this, we had the opportunity to just, like... <laughs> Put out, put out a, just like a bonus one, just a bonus one that sucks and that's what makes it good. And you don't really often get that opportunity. So hell yeah, that was great. Um, oh man, that was fun. Anyway, <laughs> I'm going to play. I'm gonna play Resident Evil 4 today. Here, I got I got some new glasses, and I gotta take these off because like they're starting to like dig into my ears a little bit in a way that I'm not super into. Anyway, by the way, Sonic is dead. Yeah. Okay. So also speaking of, yeah, I've seen. So I've obviously I've seen I've seen everything about um the murder of Sonic. I haven't played it yet because if you haven't seen, I actually did announce this as well on Twitter. Um, I am actually going to gather. Some of the same fandom cast uh, that did like Shadow Dub and Sonic Destruction. Lazy Lesbian, thank you so much for the $50 tip. Oh my God, thank you. <laughs> so sweet, I appreciate it. Um, I'm going to gather some of the real time fandom cast and we are going to stream the murder of Sonic and like do the character voices and all that stuff. Right now, I am thinking that is going to be on Tuesday, which, you know, those of you who have been following the streams, We'll know that that's, that's going to be a bit of a... Um, obviously, I did not expect Murder of Sonic to come out, so I am going to have to push some stuff around to make that fit. I apologize for people who are looking forward to Dragon Quest on Tuesday. Um, I'm not going to be able to stream on Wednesday night unless I do it really, really, really late, which I could, but I don't know how many people would be down for that, and I don't know how much I would be down for that because I don't want to fuck up my sleepy schedule too much. Um, in the near future. So I don't know. I'm I might not be able to stream on Wednesday because Mario movie. But then now Tuesday is like, oh shit, now Tuesday I gotta do uh I gotta do Murder of Sonic. Cause I don't want to wait another week to do something like that. Uh because that's like that feels somewhat time sensitive. I feel like people would be down to see it either way, like whenever it comes out, but that I wanna get it out sooner rather than later. So yeah. I don't know when I'm going to be able to do, to do Dragon Quest, because, like, I was thinking, like, okay, if I just do RE4 tonight, I could do Dragon Quest tomorrow, but then I was like, oh, shit, 
no, I can't. I have plans tomorrow night as well. So, like, maybe I could do Monday, but then I'm like, fuck. Oh, fuck. What the fuck? I hope I don't jack off. <laughs> no. But then I'm like, but Monday, I'm like, God, given the past, like, week, given the past couple weeks and this weekend, I'm like, I might just want to take Monday off. It's a lot. So apologies as to how, like, scattershot the schedule is going to be for the next week or so. We're going to get it back on track uh, after this next week um, until the release of, what's the next big game coming out? Star Wars? Let's see. Yeah, yeah, okay. So Star Wars comes out April 28th, so we have some time. Oh, yeah. So after next week, we have, like, almost three full weeks at the very least to uh, finish RE4 and get to a good point in Dragon Quest where we can maybe take a longer break once uh, Tears of the Kingdom comes around. So we should be good to go. So yeah, apologies if this next week is a little bit um, scattershot. Like I said, yeah, everything is happening so much. Um, shadow dropping stuff is fun, but I feel like the season of shadow drops needs to like kind of slow down a little bit. <laughs> it's like it's kind of y'all are putting a wrench in my plans lately. Uh, but yeah. Um, okay. So that being said. Um, Horsey Books was right. Yeah, wasn't he the wasn't he the one that said everything is happening so much, or whatever? Yeah, that's a that's an all timer. God, y'all remember? I I remember this because it was like a fucking moment of like raw, unadulterated anxiety for me when this happened. Y'all remember when Horsey Books was like folded into um like an ARG? That just turned into like I guess like a, like a, I don't know if it was failed or not, but it was like a weird like kind of like online like browser of mystery game or whatever, and then it just compl like it just disappeared. <laughs> you remember that? I specifically remember it because I actually was on the other end of that where I didn't know anything about horse ebooks, but I did know about. The other piece of the puzzle in that ARG, uh, which was pronunciation book, specifically one of my and I specifically only knew about it when the ARG first started because um, there were like two sides to that. It was like horsey books started posting like cryptic tweets and then pronunciation book was like a YouTube channel that had been running for like a couple of years just like doing pronunciation tutorial videos essentially like how to pronounce such and such word you'll still you still see channels like that nowadays but then suddenly out of nowhere pronunciation books started counting down from 77 in its videos and one day a video comes out and it says and the video is just how to pronounce 77 and then the video starts and the guy on the mic is like something is going to happen in 77 days and then he starts just speaking in like cryptic nonsense and you start hearing like morse code and then Literally for 77 days after that, he would keep putting out videos that was like, something's going to happen in 76 days. Something's going to happen in 75 days. And the reason I know about this was because a friend at the time <laughs> messaged me, <laughs> messaged me the fucking, the countdown videos. and was like, hey, have you seen this? And we just started talking about it. And I was like, no, I don't know anything about this. And he was like, yeah, this, this channel just started like, counting down from 77 and just saying like all this cryptic really creepy shit and personally i had also at exactly the same time i'm not kidding at, a, at around exactly the same time i know around exactly is an oxymoron work with me here at around the same time i had been like inundated with this idea that the sun was imminently going to emit like a solar flare that knocked out all electricity on the planet. Like legitimate, like doomsday prep conspiracy theory kind of stuff. I had been like, I, I had been told this stuff and I didn't know if I believed it or whatever. But then suddenly at the same time, pronunciation book starts counting down from 77. And my friend is like, have you heard about this thing? By the way, I was like fucking 12 at the time. Like, like I'm like, I'm a kid at this point. You have to remember. Um, and so the whole time I'm sitting there and like literally, and I kid you not, 
for the entire like 77 days my friend and i were following this thing watching it like a hawk and we were so <laughs> scared <laughs> the entire time and then and then the final day comes around we have to go to school <laughs> separate schools and i remember just sitting in class that entire day being like oh god oh god oh god oh god <laughs> I was like, oh god what's gonna fucking happen today this is gonna be insane and then the final video comes out on pronunciation books channel and it's called how to pronounce horse ebooks <laughs> and i watched the video and it's just this stupid fucking video game <laughs> and, then, and then nothing happened <laughs> nothing happened the rest of the day and then horsey books was dead <laughs> so it's pronunciation book all because of Bear Stearns Bravo I don't even know I don't even know how it did was it a success was it was it a successful just for, for the sake of it being performance art I don't know man yeah it was an ad for their interactive YouTube game about Bear Stearns not a joke no yeah that's exactly it it was called Bear Stearns Bravo I don't know anything about it to this day. I just know that I was completely on the outside of it because I thought it was a fucking doomsday clock. I thought it was a fucking end of the world countdown. Because of, because a friend of mine who had like similar anxiety <laughs> sent it to me under that pretext. And I, and I came in with like all the weird conspiratorial shit that I had heard and we just fucking like, we fed each other this nonsense into like a frenzy. It was so funny. It's so funny looking back on it. Oh my God. Oh, yeah. Oh man. It was, it was crazy. Oh man. I, I can't, I can't, now I'm just like, I'm. Oh man, what a I didn't even I did not expect to be thinking about that. How many years ago was that? I I was like I was anywhere from 12 to 14. I like it was it was a while ago. Like I was a kid. I was like a preteen. Um or well, maybe early preteen to early teen 2013, I think. It had to have been yeah, it had to have been like 2013 to Well, fuck. What am, what am I doing? I can, I can literally look this up. Hold on. Let me look up. Hold on pronunciation book when did this happen <laughs> yeah <how> to <laughs> this is fucking... here hey you guys want to see it i forgot this is public knowledge you guys want to see it? <laughs> something is <laughs> hold on oh my god hearing this voice oh my god this takes me back okay hold on so this this was the first video. You you might be able to understand even if even if it's still fucking hilarious, which it is. You might be able to understand why like a 13 14 year old at the time thought this was the creepiest shit in the world. <laughs> Something is going to happen in 77 days. <laughs> oh man, no, but you have to understand. Okay, so it wasn't just that. It was that, and then, like, you get you get further down the list. So, let's go to, like, 34. While I was waiting for her to come over one night, I made a list of objects that I had moved with my hands that day. The first object I moved was the sheet that covered me in bed when I woke up. <laughs> the sixth object I moved was a box of baking soda that I left on a shelf in my bathroom to absorb odor. I moved the baking soda to the side so I could reach the seventh item I moved. An unopened box that contained the eighth item. A new <laughs> tube of toothpaste. Like, and you have to realize this was sending me into a fucking threat. The 85th item I moved was a jar that I dropped. I stopped writing the list at 85 and thought about the... Where is he the, say? This is about the jar as a vase 
took photos of the jar. Water was temperate <laughs> instead of pens. <laughs> we'll never going. understand that to happen. Yeah, oh, yeah. Something is going to happen in 34 <laughs> days. And then, you listen. There's like Morse code and shit at the end. And then, let me show you. The last video. <laughs> Can you fucking imagine thinking the like the world is about to enter a post apocalypse like your like fucked up 13 year old mind is like everything is about to be over and nobody knows but me and then suddenly you hear horse ebooks <laughs> horse ebooks fuck oh my god i'm fucking sweating <laughs> Horse ebooks. Oh my god, did you feel betrayed when this came out? I felt fucking relieved, are you kidding me? Hey, I, I genuinely had a suspicion the world was going to end. I was, I was, I was ready to jump across the rooftops. Like, I was seriously, I was like, that was the best day of school I ever had. <laughs> Lady comes up. Horse ebooks. Horse ebooks. <laughs> it's morning in cyberspace, and the systems are in love. Wait, hold on. Wait, and then she says, "She's and I fucking you. I promise you, I've not watched this in like five plus years. I'm gonna show you right now how much this is burned into my memory." She's gonna say, "A spam bot in a channel. What would the parents think? A spam bot in a channel. <laughs> what would the parents think?" <laughs> Together again. Oh, we fuck together again. Oh my god, I'm fucking screaming. I can't. My brain is broken. <laughs> Irreparably busted. Oh my god. Why is she just standing? <laughs> oh my god. Fuck. Thank you for sharing this. Hey, thanks for thanks for listening. Hey y'all. I'm gonna be honest, I, I'm like, I'm fucking sweating right now. I'm laughing so hard. I'm also wearing a hoodie. It's like really, really hot in my room right now. I'm going to take a second. I'm gonna go to the break screen. I'm gonna change into not a hoodie. When I come back, we'll start Resident Evil 4. Um, well, hold on. Bitrate's going a little funky right now. That's not super good. Assuming the stream is still alive, when I get back, we'll start Resident Evil 4. Okay. Changing to a parka will do. BRB. Something is going to happen in 77 days. I am the mouse. Ebooks. I am the mouse. Ebooks. Oh my god. <laughs> mouse ebooks. Hey everybody. Oh my god. I need a second. <sighs> Fuck. I'm still like. By the way, um, lest we not forget, I pulled up those videos actually to figure out when that happened. I completely forgot about that. Hold on. The stream thumbnail is it horse ebooks this was nine years ago yeah this was 2013 oh my god so what yeah so this was september of 2013 how old would i have been i'm 24 now birthday in august so fucking wait okay so like 20 23 i would have been 15 Sorry, I'm not I I'm not good at head calculation. Not right now at least. 15, I was the same age. Crazy. Okay, so a little older than I expected, but still, um I was a very stupid 15 year old, so that makes sense. Oh my god. Man. I was 13, definitely online, and did not know how. 
Uh, well, this this wasn't like a crazy big event. Like literally, no one else I knew was even aware of it. Um, aside from like my friend and I. So it wasn't like you. It wasn't like you had any reason to know about it. Oh my god. Okay. Um, so last time, oh man, I'm so, I'm like out of breath, I like can't focus. <laughs> okay, so last time we played Resident Evil 4, um, we got to the part where Ashley got separated, and unfortunately, due to some, uh, internet issues that will hopefully not be repeated as badly, um, but preferably not at all. Um, I have been noticing some bitrate fluctuation, but honestly, it's actually the normal kind of bitrate fluctuation that I'm totally down for. And we're just dropping frames rather than losing the stream entirely so far. Big thumbs up on that. I will take that gladly. 100% prefer that over, over complete stream shutdowns. Anyway, um, so last time... Uh, we were making our way, trying to find Ashley and get back to her. Unfortunately, we had to stop, like, r like right smack in the middle of a level. Um, and, oh my god, I, like, really fucked up my throat laughing at that so hard. One second, I apologize. Fuck. The last time you were running from the giant? Um, no, I don't think we've met the giant yet. <laughs> We were, uh, we were walking up some stairs, basically. Um, I forget if the save file I've, I currently have loaded, um, is perfectly caught up with where we were, uh, or maybe even if it's, like, a little bit beyond. I'm not sure, but, uh, let's, uh, let's find out. How about it? Um, oh shit, the audio's not on. <laughs> Oh, man. Okay. So. Let me get my bearings here. It's been a second. Oh, my God. I'm so happy to be playing this game again. Okay, so. Right. Okay, so this bridge isn't lowered yet. Which makes me think... We did make some progress through here, but there is a chance that it may have been reset. Which, honestly, I am mostly fine with. Let me see. What do I have on me? I have two knives. Okay. Got a first aid spray. Oh, that's pretty good. <clears throat> oh my god, I apologize about the amount of times I'm going to have to clear my throat. I need to... <laughs> I, maybe, I maybe shouldn't start the stream with fucking earth-shatteringly funny uh, anecdotes. Yeah, okay, we did, we did have to restart a little bit. That's fine. That's true, but also, fuck you. Once was enough. <laughs> Wait, that's so funny. Hey. Okay. Oh, I don't have any rifle ammo. That's not good. Rifles would be great right about now. Right, these guys. I totally forgot. Oh, my God. Just caught up. You were a few minutes past this point. Yeah, that's what I figured. Shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, go, 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 go. That's fine. We'll just run for now. Nope, never mind. That's not gonna work out. That guy has a skive. Get over there. I replace all my skies with Discord. <laughs> That's not what that is. Oh, shit, you're right. Oh, yeah, no, we did go past this because I remember right here was when Leon and I were, like, weirdly on the same page. And he, like, started kind of let's playing his own shit. I will... <laughs> Oh, that was so disgusting. Oh my god, I just got like the chills all over my body. The chills? What am I, 80? Well, actually, according to Google, apparently. Oh my god, Koo, thank you so much for the raid. Hi, 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 hi. We discovered an MLF hideout. I'd like you to investigate. I'm so sorry. This is a bad time. I'm a little bit, um... I'm a, <laughs> I'm a little bit stressed right now. I unfortunately... I've drained most of my resources as of late. 
Oh, fuck. Oh, man. That was an opportunity that I missed. Whoop. Come on. Come on. Come on. Damn it. That's fine. It's okay. We can make it through. Discovered a MILF hideout? <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, good. You were playing a... Uh... Oh, shit. I just recognized what that is from. You were fucking playing Last of Us Part 2, weren't you? <laughs> oh, man. Yep, yeah, that's awesome. I... I know that game is divisive. I personally really like it. I hope you have a good time with it. Um... But either way, I'm excited to go through and see some of your reactions to stuff. Uh, so hey, thanks for thanks for checking out. I'm enjoying it so far. Awesome. How far did y'all get? Did you get to? Uh, did you get to Seattle? I don't want to say too much. I'm keeping an open mind and forcing everyone to be adult about it. That's the best. That's the best way to go. Open the Fedra gate when you get there and stop. Okay, cool. So yeah, you've, you've got to, I'll just say the inciting incident. Um, obviously, one of the more immediately, uh, what's the word? Um, fucking, what's the, it starts with a con, I think? Controversial, there we go. <laughs> I can't think of words right now, man. I'm so, my brain is fried after today. Evo Japan Tekken Top 8 is on. Oh, I think that part is great. Me too. It makes me fucking sob. Um, yeah. We, <laughs> we, hey, we can, uh, I'll, uh, I assume that, uh, the Tekken comment was implying you gotta bounce. Uh, either way, though, uh, I'll let you do your thing. Thank you so much for the raid again. To be fair, you're under attack from many assailants. That's true. <laughs> no, that's why I ended. Talk to you later. See ya. Have a great night. Hey, here we go. I got some new ammo. This part confused me for far too long. The frustrating thing is that I've <laughs> played through this part before, but also, to be fair, I did also play through it while I was um complaining about the internet. So... Hey, uh, fingers crossed. <laughs> we won't have to make similar complaints tonight. I really, really hope this new modem works out. One, it was fucking expensive. And two, um, it would just be nice to have that be a so solution. Oh, I was so worried that wasn't going to work. Okay, we're getting into it. Sorry, I, I needed some time. Obviously, as you can imagine, I'm very sort of in my own head today. Putting out a big new project is like, it's um, it's it's like a poison to being in the moment, right? So I'm very sort of like hyper vigilant about like what I'm doing and what people think of me right now. <laughs> I'm just like, so, um, but I'm 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 finding myself. I'm definitely settling into <laughs> settling into this a little more. But also now I'm dying, so that's not super great. Here we go. That's it. It's today's been wild. No, it's been crazy. It's been truly insane. I can't believe I honestly kind of shocked I, I followed through on this stream. One, it's so late, which is like prime uh, internet shitting time. And then two, uh, it's also been quite a day for me. Dude, get the legs. There we go. There we go. Awesome. Perfect. You wanna let me parry? Oh, bye knife. Come on. Oop. There we go! Awesome, perfect, amazing. Look at him go! Whoa! <laughs> Look at his adventures he's having. I hope you have a great day, sir. Okay. I actually... In between streams, I remember I actually went through here and got some of these treasures that I missed. But now the save put me before the treasures, so I'm like, what the hell? Do I have to go back and get them again? And that stinks. Penny kills a man, have a great day, sir. Oh, what, so I'm supposed to kill someone and be impolite? <laughs> 
maybe to you Gen Z folks, but me, a millennial, we pride ourselves on being polite. I don't actually know if I, I, I actually think I'm technically Gen Z. <laughs> I, I think for a while it was like really undetermined where the kind of like birth date separation was, but I think at a certain point people determined it was like, okay, it's like 1997 and above your millennial. And I'm like, but, 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 Gen Z is TikTok and I don't use TikTok. Why did you turn into Pearl? Ah, give me the herb, give me the herb. <laughs> Fuck. The herb tricked me. The herb tricked me with the promise of safety, but also that- Oh my god, there's no fucking way. Okay. Alright. <laughs> Shut up. Well, I'm not on the ceiling, dicknips. Welcome. What can I interest you in? Mmm. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, fuck. I can't craft any ammo. I can't like I Welcome. Uh, I'm like should I buy an upgrade? I don't know, man. Knife needs care everyone. I don't know if an upgrade would do anything as much as just like having another option for health restoration. Why not try Let's just get another first aid spray. Pleasant travels. You know what? Oh. Hold on. Let's make a fucking bolt. Let's make a bolt. Can we make more mines? We cannot make more mines. We need three more gunpowder. Damn. Okay, well, at least we have the case. I believe we have the case that drops more gunpowder. Yes, awesome, perfect. Okay, well, now we can at the very least, we have one grenade bolt. We have one attachable mine, I mean, more specifically. What are you talking about? I'm talking about detachable mines, something you wouldn't know a thing about. I literally sold you the blueprint for those, mate. <laughs> what the hell? Star, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. She said meeting, she said you, meeting you was enough. once enough. Uh, no, I want to save that. I really want to save that. Man, this is gonna piss me off. <laughs> this guy's about to check off. Whoa, 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 go, go, go. You know what? Hey, how about this? Let's just do some jukes for now. Let's not go too crazy on the bullet usage. If I can help it. Oh my god, this is the scariest thing I've ever heard in my life. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Go, 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 that's fine. You're gonna, like, possess somebody else, but that's totally okay. Damn it. Nope, it's not okay. I maybe back myself into a corner, quite literally. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Go, 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 go! <laughs> what the fuck are you doing, man? Let's go. Let's get the hell out of here. Whoa! I didn't know you were so close. All right, all right, all right. Hey. <laughs> Something is happening and I can't really tell. That's okay. Whoa, go, 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 go. Hey, we have two first aid sprays. I'm still fucking stuck, man. Okay, I'll use one of these. You still up? Stop moving. If 
you just keep pressing buttons, eventually they die. That's what I've learned. god okay my expectations of the remake were like rock bottom can't relate um i mean like obviously i didn't know if it was gonna like live up to the original in a sense um but then again also to be fair i didn't have the perspective of someone who grew up on the original i literally just played it for the first time last year and i loved it and there was still that that nervousness of like do they do they really need to make re4 remake but also at the same time I have loved basically every single one of these RE remakes. Um, even even three, I had a great time playing, even though I know that one was more um, divisive. But like, I don't know, Capcom's kind of been on a roll with these RE games recently in my book. So I was already like, I was ready to see what they did no matter what. And then after that demo, oh man. You're still up? No, you're not, okay. Oh boy. All right. Well, we have we have another first aid spray. Why is your ass jiggling? Stop! Put that thing away. What the fuck, man? That was so cool. Do that again. Oh, he can't. He dropped it. Can't imagine why. I gotta get that chest. That's the thing I got between streams that now the game doesn't remember that I got. It doesn't believe me. Where are you? Yo, watch this. This is why this game fucking rules. Look at that. Is it? Is that? This game fucking sucks. I'm deleting it. Bye. See ya later. Oh shit, Ashley. Oh my god, I totally forgot. Sorry, sorry. What are you doing? <laughs> Praying. Oh, fuck. Leon! <laughs> Just another one for the road. Sorry, I'm trying to, <laughs> I'm trying to get it. I don't need to, but yet. Every time you play the Ashley sound clips, it reminds me how much better a voice actress is in this. Hey, you put some fucking respect on Sandy Cheeks right now. <laughs> hey, respect your elders. <laughs> Sorry, must have slipped. Dude, I love that line so much. I'm glad he says it a million and eight thousand times. There we go. Another ornate necklace. Perfect. Oh my god, he quips too. Oh, he quips like nobody's business. It's so funny. Um, even though this is like a direct sequel to RE2 remake. Um, and this Leon is the exact same Leon in RE2 Remake canonically. Um, he actually feels closer to original RE4 Leon than RE2 Remake Leon in my book, which I am, I'm very happy about. I find that actively, uh, delightful. I'm very glad they did it that way. <laughs> Don't leave your feet exposed! Mistake number one here on Snap Cube. Give me a break already. <laughs> what does that mean? That was the worst thing I could have said. I don't know, man. I'm sorry. Hey, Mo. 
Making the castle safer, one ass stab at a time. Oh, this is where I'm supposed to be going. Oh, right. Oh, I forgot. Wait. And how to... Uh... Oh, shit. There's, like, ammo I haven't picked up. Is that down there? I don't even know, man. Okay, hold on. I'm not gonna go up there just yet. Oh, it's right here. Look at that. Just waiting for me. That <laughs> one dude just do a Marilyn Monroe. I think a lot of them have for some reason. Like not, the, the physics are being a little funny today. I wonder if I can, I don't think I can get back over there. At least not without like, oh, you know what, actually? Oh shit, I don't know. It's hard to say. I don't want to fuck up all my progress with, like, the... I don't want to reset all the gate settings. I don't think I should. I'm just going to keep going. It's just windy. Dude, it was windy today. Like, crazy. I had my hair looking all nice. Walk outside to go to the micro center. Quite literally within two seconds of being outside. My... My bob was fucked up. My curtain bangs. Destroyed. Here we go. Okay, admittedly, I walked a little too far off stream and had this spoiled. <laughs> but also, look at this motherfucker. What the hell? A giant pain in your ass? Leon, you shouldn't have. Okay, uh, hey, what? Okay, so we gotta go this way. The yellow paint has, has told me. <laughs> Stop looking for ammo, bitch! Sorry, I'm just... I, I just want you to be well-situated for the situations ahead. Ah! Oh my god, that's so scary. Why did that feel so close? Because it was. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Oh my god, we just gotta go, probably. Is there anything over here that I should... Okay, no, they really just want me to run. All right, cool. Noted. Oh, this is awesome. Wait, how? Oh, shit. <laughs> no way! No way! Oh my god, NPC Joe's like he's so under the sun! Oh my god, I'm fucking delighted! No way! He just got obliterated! Oh man. Oh, this is the best game anyone's ever made, I think. I think with that, we can finally call it. There's not gonna, they're not gonna do a better one. How could they? Did you, did you see that? Oh, okay. Explosive barrel, noted. No, don't, hold on, not yet. I'm gonna save this for later. Shit, man. Knees, head, knees, head, legs, head. There we go. Okay, do we have, we have a first aid spray. Oh, we have, um, what can we make? Some machine gun ammo, rifle ammo. I, some rifle ammo would hit like nobody's business right about now. I don't know if I wanna, oh, I should also probably just go ahead and use this. Save my pride. For when it's actually deserved or necessary. Hey, um, oh, I see, I see, I see. Whoa, 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 whoa. Maybe I do or don't see? No, I see, okay. Okay, throw the stuff in. Go, 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 go up the ladder. Oh my god, this is insane. Run, 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 run. Oh man, all right, we're good. Yes. Tannin. 
<laughs> oh man. Again, fucking Penny Parker coming in with the Tom and Jerry War of the Whiskers to hear laugh sound effects. Completely involuntarily. I am the beetle. Dude, I gotta start just like using parry what rather than like jabbing them over and over again. Like, what am I doing? Okay. Quit that. Quit. No. Fuck! I was trying to parry that. I thought it would be cool if I parried the big, uh, bolts. The flaming bolt. You're still up? No. Okay. You're good. Okay. I should probably just grab this now. Get up there. Oh, shit. I forgot that doesn't have yellow paint on it. Sorry, I don't know why I'm... I think, the, I think the yellow paint is a good design decision that I actively welcome. I don't know why I'm ragging on it so much on stream. Me actively makes fun of things that I like. <laughs> okay. Go, go, go. Sometimes I feel like this game is too loud, and other times I feel like it needs to speak up, girl. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There we go. Okay. Get ready. You can't go, 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 go. Oh my god. It's the slowest cannon anyone's ever created. Adios, son of a bitch. Adios, you son of a bitch. Perfect. Amazing. It's probably more. Hold on. Oh, does it like have a little. Oh, it has a little indicator. I didn't even notice that. Die, dumbasses. You're still alive? I'm considering keeping you alive at that point. Holy fuck. You did good. Alright. Open for traffic. Hold on, don't fucking whisper like that. Who said that? Oh, it was the guy by the door. Hey. Are you gonna leave me alone if I run past you? No! <sighs> okay, well. Last chance. No. You are so strong. Why are you so strong? I thought that was going to take one shot, bro. I thought this was going to take one shot. I like can't believe it. Yo, what did that open? I just did something, I feel like. What did that do? The door- oh, just open this door again? Weird. Okay. I guess we can go back now. I want to keep you alive because honestly, sir, I respect you. Leave me alone and we, we, we won't have nothing to say to each other. Hey, if you can chill, I can chill. I respect you. What the fuck? Run! Run, other guy, run! You can handle him, I know it. I hope you have a long and fruitful life. Well, then Sorry. I guess we can't fucking go back. Guys. He's so funny. So, like, straight up, why... Why would there have been an option to just open... Oh, probably, I mean, just probably to clear out the room before you get past the point of no return. I don't know why I'm overthinking it so much. It's literally just there so you can go back if you haven't played the way I've done. Where I picked up literally everything way sooner than I needed to. Oh, you can go back? Oh, okay. I didn't realize. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't look like you can, but I'll, hey, I'll take your word for it. Not that like, I need to know either way. Because we're not doing that. 
Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no, this place looks so different. Oh my god. I don't know how to think of it. Ashley, oh. where are you? Oh god, the dog maze looks so much cooler, but so much scarier. It's so cool. The environmental design is such a step up, but also, I'm gonna piss. <laughs> like, this is so scary. Okay, alright, let's go. Oh. I gotcha. <gasps> no way, 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 no way. Who's? 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 It's Ashley Ticket. Oh, shit! Um, woke Capcom be like, COVID safety is important. Please wear your... <laughs> Sorry. We respect a mask-wearing lady. Oh, shit! She just here? Oh, oh no! Oh, stay back. I might hurt you again. I'm so scared. When that happened, I wasn't myself anymore. I was something else. Oh, she must have been terrifying now. I know. Oh no, I'm gonna cry. You too. Um, it's okay to be afraid, you know. But you can't run. You gotta keep moving forward. We will beat this. Together. I don't know if I can. You can. Just give me a heads up before you stab me next time, okay? <laughs> Stop! No, it's not the time, you stupid motherfucker. <laughs> Thanks. Oh no, that was so sweet. Oh my god, that was so good. Uh, what the hell? Why did they do it so good? Who gave them permission to do it so good? Uh, what the fuck? I love that! They like actually fucking talk to each other and stuff, like... Man. Luis, where are you? Sorry, I, uh, I screwed up. Come to my rescue, Prince Charming. I'll show you your charm, pal. Come on. I'm in the ballroom past the courtyard. Don't be late to the dance. <laughs> can't believe that guy. He's in trouble. We can't just leave him, right? Oh, fuck. I guess we can't. The mission status told me to head to the ballroom. Mission status? Okay, we're not gonna do it. Like, we're not gonna do this thing, right? What? This, like, bit that fucking Penny does where, like, it's... You know, it's like, oh, I'm the main character, so I know all about the game mechanics, and it's like meta. But it's like, oh, you're the you're the side character, you're like the companion character, and you're kind of like removed from all the player mechanics, so you don't know anything. Like, are we really doing this again? It's like I'm. I swear to God, this has happened like every companion-based playthrough. I'm trapped. Aren't we all? It was funny. <laughs> I didn't know what else to say. So I just played I'm Trapped, hoping that it would, uh... Like, uh... <laughs> like, like, jingling keys in front of chat to make the joke funny. <laughs> hey guys, it's the thing you, you like, right? Did you like it? Okay. Um... Let's go ahead and... Let's keep that on hand. We like sound bite. Oh, I have another first aid spray in the box. Great. Okay, I'll use that then right now so that I can save this for when we find a red herb. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, anything else? Nope. 
I don't have any other ideas, good or bad. Mad or sad. Glad or bad. I'm a bad dream! Okay, um, we ready? Yeah, I think we're ready to go. Wait, so Ashley is gonna be with me in the courtyard? Okay. A little bit weird, but I'm down for it, I guess. Be a lot more stressful now. Oh my god. I'm y'all, I'm so scared, genuinely. This is they just added so much stress on top of this segment already. Just by the fact that now Ashley is here. And I have to like take take care of her at the same time. Oh no. This fucking stinks, man. This stinks. This is poo poo. This is garbage. This is Thancred. Oh. oh, sorry, that's just specular highlight glitching from the DLSS mod that makes this game possible for me to stream from my PC. <laughs> I don't know what to think. Oh no. I maybe should have nabbed a couple of those. What the fuck is that? Stop! Is that you? Is that the birds? I never want to hear that sound ever again in my life. I swear to God, if I hear it, someone's going to pay. Stop! Crouch! Walk! We can just walk normally. I'm so scared! I'm so scared! Whoa, my mouse. Whoa, weird. Woo, looks like my mouse is on drugs. Crazy. Whoa. Okay. Um. What is this? This is gonna be like, whoa, shit. Okay. Okay. A little bit weird, but. What's what's this like start and stop thing you're doing? What? Can you not just like, oh fuck? You okay? The leaves. Yeah, I know. Get in my eyes too. Okay, no seriously, like wh you keep running and then stopping, like you're you're catching up. Like I'm I'm going too fast, but I'm not running anywhere. I'm just walking. Can we not just match pace? Can't you do that? Ashley. I'm sorry to say, I don't think we'll be making it out of here tonight. What? I just don't think there's much I can do. Um, honestly, I feel like uh, we kind of got to call it here. Uh, we're gonna... We're gonna set up camp. Um, and then hopefully... Uh, do you know uh, I Spy? Like the road trip game? Yeah, I Spy. Let's play I Spy. Until we're both- <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Actually... Was not expecting them to follow Go me right. that far. <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. I was trying to get away from the dogs, but they could smell me. How? Anyway, okay, let's just go. Honestly... I'm ready to embrace the sweet fucking, uh... Siren song of death itself and danger and all things oppressive and awful but beautiful in this cold, sick fucking world of God and Satan and love and despise and hatred and disdain but also adoration and rever reverence. Get fucked! Two times! And maybe more if you decide it's time to wake up again. But 
But that's up to you. Not often we on this God's green earth get a chance to sleep in. I'm telling you directly. Sleep in. Or it'll be the last sleep you take, the next one that you have. <laughs> Ashley. Yeah? My machine gun isn't fully upgraded. Why are you telling me that? Just want... I just want you to know. If you're scared, it's okay. You have every reason to be scared. Hey, okay. get up. Yeah. Nice puppy. <laughs> I love how more often than not, whether it's intentional or not, they actually have often been like waiting for me while I <laughs> raise her from incapacitated state. Well, there goes my knife. Can you maybe stop like live tweeting whenever stuff goes wrong at me? It's not tweeting, we're talking. Yeah, but you know what I mean, right? I've never used Twitter. I don't know anything about... What? I should remember they took away my verified badge today. Sorry, I, I'd i never used the platform. Fuck. Fuck. You okay? No, I'm not. It's the dogs, it's not anything else. Hey, quit, shut up. One down. One down. 78 to go. I would love if you were not coming around the corner like that. Where are you? They like really, they made this one crazy, didn't they? <laughs> Me looking at Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> to laugh at my joke, my own joke that hard. I think I can't have someone looking at like a picture of Crash Bandicoot and being like, whoa, this guy, <laughs> this guy's <is> nuts. <laughs> what were they smoking when they did this guy? <laughs> this guy is insane. Oh man. Hey, don't let him near pointy objects. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> crash, crash. Are you there, crash? Crash, crash. Yeah. No sweat? No. Yeah, no sweat. I'm just thinking about Crash Bandicoot. All is well, if you ask me. Crash! 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 Are you there, Crash? Crash! <laughs> Genuinely, very effective, um... Jump scare repellent is to constantly be out loud talking, thinking, and giggling about Crash Bandicoot while you play this part of the game. Get Anytime. serious. 
This isn't a game. I say, knowing. Uh oh. <laughs> Let this one out of the. <laughs> For Finn. She's almost as crazy as Bash. Bash Grandicoot with this one. Oops. Oh man. Hey, people coming from a. Hey, people coming from Koo's stream, if you're still around. What'd you think about Smash Brandy's cooch? It was awesome, right? <laughs> it, was really, it was like really cool. I'm not alone in thinking that was epic. How do we feel about uh, Smash Brandy's cooch? It was so good, dude. <laughs> Fuck! Oh! C hold F, control yeah, order. Hold down. Okay. I think this really says something about her society. Crash! 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 <laughs> Sorry. Is this anything? I don't know, you tell me! Hey, hey donate five dollars if this is anything. I'm kidding, I'm, don't actually do that. Hey, if you're gonna spend five dollars on the channel, subscribe. I'm, this is, this is my decree. Oh my god, there's more of them. They created more of these guys? Like, for fun? Uh-oh. Who let them do that? I realize. <laughs> hey, don't fuck with my lady. <laughs> or like, maybe even you won't have a head by tomorrow morning. You got two of them at once? That was literally, you're not gonna believe me, that was intentional. I was waiting for that. Lazy lesbian, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. I appreciate it. Hey, I said five dollars. Not five times five dollars. Where's the math? Tournament arc, thank you for the five dollars. I didn't say spend five dollars. I said subscribe for five dollars. Where's the math? What's going on, man? Uh, okay. What did we get? Head for the balloon. Oh no, sorry, ballroom. Um <laughs> Claire, I feel thank you so much for gifting it to your one sub to uh uh Tazikiki Claire. I appreciate it. Uh you're one, thank you. <laughs> Let me figure out what I'm doing here. <laughs> Porter, thank you for the resub. <laughs> I'm sorry that I'm I'm sorry that I've coerced you into spending money on me. <laughs> I, listen. As long as you're doing it for your own desire. Maybe shouldn't. Ashley. God. Ashley. Do it again. I know it went great the first time. But do it again. Oh my god, there's so many subs! Thank you! No, genuinely, seriously, thank you so much. That really means a lot. Oh, wait, oh, we Oh, I see. Wait. There's something to this. What did this open? I genuinely have no fucking idea what that opened. I, like, completely missed it. I was too busy thinking about Crash. Crash? Crash? Are you there, Crash? Hey, wait. Crash. Oh, wait, did it open? Did it just open this? I think it just opened that. No, there's more to this. Oh, wait, there's la- Oh, I see there's ladders. Oh. Where are you going? Right, okay. Whoa, and then even there's probably gonna spawn more guys down there that are gonna be like harder to fight. Dun, do, 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 do,
we gotta go. Oh, we gotta. Oh, we gotta go around here. And probably nothing scary is gonna happen if we go through this door. Yeah, see, there definitely wasn't a little bit of like a like a growling noise there if you were listening closely. Crash! 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 I can't stop doing that mass noise. I'm gonna go and say no. Once you start, it's like <laughs> so hard to stop. Uh, Bandana, and thank you for gifting a sub to Soft Boy Mudkip. Can finally get out of this maze. Now we can finally. <gasps> Fuck. Nothing will happen now. Damn it. I was wrong again. Whoa! Crash? Oh, I'm almost dead. See, is it bad to say her her cries of like pure fucking raw, uncomfortable despair are actually really helpful to me right now? How else would I know that I'm dying if someone else was not in despair about it? Uh oh. Ashley. Sorry, Ashley. I was reloading. You must Go understand, right. correct? Yeah. I'm fine. Hey. How about now? Are you still fine? The second time? I think so. We got ourselves someone who's resilient, folks. Uh-oh, there's even more. Yikes! Run! <laughs> Ashley, run! Ashley, you don't understand how important it is that you keep up with me right the fuck now. Hey, wait a second. There's gotta be more secrets to discover. That's about it. I mean, we left some pesetas. But do we really need the money? Ashley, are you alright? Yeah, thanks. No, we don't need the money. I was gonna make a joke and run ahead, but then I was like, oh, I'm actively, like, really in danger. Oh, here we go. Okay, now that you're done with this section, I can say this, but my favorite line in this game is is from this part where Ashley says she wants to keep one of the dogs if it, like, tackles her. That's fucking hilarious. I don't know if I just missed that, like, in-game or if I heard it and didn't notice it. Also, that ended up being a lot less stressful than I thought it was going to be. Am I crazy? I think the original version of that was actually a lot more effective. I think if I had played this version of that segment first, I maybe wouldn't even have, like, thought about this part of the game much moving forward. Maybe that's because I was talking about Crash Bandicoot the whole time, but I can't possibly be to blame. My behavior can't possibly uh, influence my <laughs> experiences with the media I consume. Might be something worse after, like, the water room. That's a good point. They did balance that out last time with like, this way. oh, the ballroom. Hey, yeah, maybe there's like a big, uh, call it a ballroom blitz, if you will. Oh shit, wait. Some new ways, stranger. Shooting range? Treat. Shooting range! Oh my God, new shooting range. New shooting range, new shooting range. I thought there was gonna be more eventually and I was correct. Oh yeah, I can't wait to find any more oh, of them. Enough. This but one's the new one, and we're gonna do it. We're gonna fucking destroy it and get to it. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be grand. We're gonna get the charms all in my hand. What's this? Merchant tip. Next level upgrades. Got some good news, mate. I recently procured some high quality tools. Now I can do even more nasty upgrades on those weapons of yours and make them sing even louder. For the right price, of course. <laughs> Give us a shout if you're interested. Nasty upgrades? Yeah. Like in what kind of way? 
Leon. What? I have needs. Fine, whatever. Destroy the blue medallion. Destroy the blue medallions. Four. Did we ever do three? Wait a second. Oh shit! We did do three. We just haven't turned it in yet. Oh no, we did. It's completed. When did we do three? At the castle gate? Oh, you're right. Wow. This is a long ass game. <laughs> okay. You know what? It feels really good to see that basically every single... Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Uh, 25 Frogs, thank you for gifting it to your one sub to uh, Days 2 Lua, so I appreciate it. Um, It feels really good to know that basically every single available... um request that we've gotten we've like completed up to this point so we're kind of on a roll in terms of like getting all the content sorted um so nine blue medallions are blemished and i want them gone let us show them that we are not afraid and that we will not stand for this where is this the grand hall oh okay okay noted oh yeah here it is wow they actually do just straight up mark them on the map wow there's a ton of fucking treasures around here huh this is going to be a crazy place to explore. Oh my god. Oh, the ballroom is going to be crazy. Okay. But of course, first, y'all know what's up, right? Like, we're on the same page here. I think it's shooting gallery time. Actually, first, first things first. Things first. It's, uh, it's merchant time. Let's see... Okay, so the ornate necklace. We can... Okay, so it's another four-slot treasure. And we can either do quartet or four colors bonus. But we can't do either of those right now. So we should... Oh, wait! Oh, shit! No, wait! Oh, it's, uh... Oh, fuck. Right, 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 right. It's two square, two circle. So we, yeah. Hmm. As long as it's red. Oh yeah, I guess we would have to just get more red ones. That's like the only one we can double up like that. Or we could just do four color. We could do four color. We could totally do four color right now if we wanted to. But I don't know. Let me let me look and see what kind of wares this guy has well, right now. I got something new for you. Case upgrade. Oh my god. What you see is what Fuck. I've got. That would go real nice right now. But that's gonna that's gonna take away like all my money. <clears throat> Which makes me think. Gotta select next time then. We should just do four colors bonus. Let's let's get the money now so we can get the case upgrade and then maybe like a couple weapon upgrades or maybe even just one. So let's do yeah, let's use up um I'll save the red gemstones in case we get more and we want to do um a a quartet bonus. Yeah, quartet bonus. Um because we can use a purple uh square one and <clears throat> still get the bonus while still having a purple left so uh yeah this is good oh my god that's so much that's so much hey not as much as the quartet bonus but honestly we're splitting hairs at that point with where we are now so welcome i didn't bother with hyper optimizing every treasure's gems and did pretty good yeah no for sure um like i know i i may be overthinking it a lot of the time but um, on top of that, I also have to remember we are actually probably pretty well ahead of the curve here in terms of our like upgrade and like money making progress because we also are taking into account the fact that a lot of the treasures we even have are like bonus treasures. 
<laughs> like from from the deluxe edition that aren't even in the base game. So we've gotten like so much money that like isn't even available to some people if they purchase the regular game. So, you know, okay, case upgrade, of course. That there's pretty me pointing at Ashley. To prepare the knife. To you, stranger. To prepare the body armor. That's good work, if I do say so myself. I'm doing my second playthrough with bonus treasures, and it's crazy. Yeah, I don't know if I've been fully like optimizing it enough, um, but maybe, maybe it's actually just like totally fine. chance out there, you best tune up your kit. Oh man, okay. I don't know what to do. I feel like I've really been. I mean, obviously, I feel like handgun is like super important just overall we could do we could do rate of fire i think rate of fire actually this kind of work is about would go pretty hard stranger. little bit goes a long way you'll see let's get another rate of fire upgrade let's really are. even that out as you wished get a power upgrade for the riot gun we're starting to get an idea of your tastes, friend. Hmm. Ammo capacity for the stingray, and then I'm gonna leave it at that, I think. Our craftsmanship demands no less. Got a selection of good things on sale, straight. Can you just so you know how fast this game can go? I started a new playthrough like 20 minutes into stream and now I'm caught up to you. Oh no, I'm aware. Um, actually, I don't know if y'all saw, but um, I actually started a hardcore save file. You see this? Um, and I had been playing for like, I don't know, like 11 minutes. And I had already like beaten the first entire like introductory section and the first chapter, like, or something like that. I don't know if that's actually correct. It's crazy. Like, um, the amount that you can get through the game just by like booking it, um, is kind of insane. Cause like th this save file, I've saved one time. And I'm in chapter two, like well part way, like well through chapter two. And um, I was just running most of the time. Honestly, I barely interacted with any enemies. I was just booking it. So I've been, uh, yeah, I've been, I've been practicing that on my own time because, because here's the thing. Here's the thing. Why not treat yourself, mate? I've been, I don't, I don't know how much I want to say this because I don't want to get people too excited. It's not a confirmation, but I've been considering a certain relevant project, wink, 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 related to this game that would require me to get through the game and record it in a reasonably um, quick and efficient amount of time with very little, like, struggle. Um, and to do something like that, I would want to have bonus weapons that I could use to get through the story without having to spend so much time trying to get through the game itself while recording. So... That is, I have been experimenting with speedrunning the game so that I can maybe just on my own time, sometime soon after I beat it, unlock some infinite weapons so that I can have them for later. <laughs> maybe. She's going to do an RE4 pronunciation guide. Resident Evil. Resident Evil. There's shit in the box. I've never smelt this before. But if I start to smell it, then I realize that it's the thing that's new to me that makes me uncomfortable. It's never the thing itself. It's always the newness. It's always the newness. 
Newness is scary in and of itself, but newness is also what makes grass grow. Something is going to happen in 84 days. Now a shotgun. That can cover a lot of area with okay. <laughs> Talk about bang for your buck. Oh shit. Oh. Oh, this is the ones we did before. Okay, cool. <laughs> Leon ebooks. Uh, those who have, who were not there at the beginning of the stream, I apologize for how little sense that made. Any look at Ashley? <laughs> Thank you. Use a submachine gun if you want to make quick work of the targets. If you can live with the lack of precision, that is. Hey, chat, thanks for showing me that. Oh my god, does she like cheer you on? You missed. Fuck! Not like you. Oh, this is gonna be a nightmare. Oh, this is gonna be an absolute nightmare. <laughs> Girls are watching. Fuck, I'm so nervous. Damn it. Oh, that's crazy. Girl, you suck, bitch. Hey, uh, d hey, d maybe don't call me that. Sorry. Nice. I love you. Just thought I'd let you know. Having a hard time hitting a target, it's all about positioning, mate. Changing scenery could be good for your focus. Three, two, one, begin! You got this, Leon. You got this, Leon. She's so cute. She's so cool. And she's like a character. She's a character that she can. Oh my god, Isla. I. That's actually good. Awesome, dude. Fuck! Ah! On earth am I supposed to even do that? We'll never escape Grinch posting. I genuinely think it's gonna take like another like year and a half for me to ever drop the Grinch posting bit. So like strap in. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> You're an artist, mate. Dude, you ever think about how whoever named the planet Uranus got us so fucking good, dude. We got fucking destroyed when they named it that. Because think about it this way. You either say Uranus, which is so fucking funny, or you say Urine Us, which is just even fucking funny also. They, like, got us... That's so funny. Three, two, one, begin. Fuck. Oh, <gasps> you son of a bitch. I knew there was something up with the fact that there were seven skulls in the shooting range, but I was only getting like three. How can there be seven if I was only getting three? And I realized, oh, there's a bonus stage, of course, but you're telling me they're gonna have four fucking skulls in the bonus stage for the TMP shooting range? I think not, sir. I think there have been some shenanigans happening and I just now realized it's in the barrels. It's always in the barrels. Everything is in the barrels. The secrets are always in the fucking barrels. 
die. And he can let loose now that late streams are on the menu. Well, we don't fully know if late streams are on the menu. Also, hey guys, fucking weird chronological discrepancy. In the fantasy world of Snapcube streams, how would Shatter know what a menu is? That's so funny. Why did Tolkien write that? I'm gonna try another one. This DMV one sucks. Distract you from the big fish. <laughs> the fuck are you talking about? So if you don't understand, then you never will, okay? Three, two, one, begin. Those guys are gay. This guy's like gay. What the hell? You're telling me shotguns have like a wide spread? What? What'd she say? just gassing me up. No, I think he means it. No, he's gassing me up. Just like you. Do you want me to not gas you up? No, I, I like it. I just... I know I didn't do good that time. That's okay. You're really nice. Now a shotgun. That can cover a lot of area with just one shield. Talk about bang for your buck. Did you know you can move during the shooting game? Um, intuitively, probably not, but also, um, even though I know it now in my conscious brain and my awake mind, I also have to be honest with myself that if I think about doing two things at once, I'll have a panic attack. <laughs> okay. It's not worth it. I haven't earned it. Way too much on a single weapon to find yourself out of ammo, mate. Way too much Yeah, well, what if that weapon is really, really good? <laughs> okay, I, that doesn't necessarily negate what I said. Fucking yo. Oh, no. Oh? Do we drop for a second? Oh, we did drop for a second, but we're back. Okay. Scary. But... Maybe okay. We'll see. Okay. We're good for now. <laughs> please, yeah, please refresh. Uh, if, you, if, you, if you lagged behind a little bit. Didn't drop for me? Okay, cool. A little bit weird, but yeah. Hey, let's hope, let's hope that's the worst it gets. Kinda, they're kind of freaking me out a little bit tonight. New modem does seem to be performing pretty well overall. Actually, we were getting kind of like incredible speeds earlier. Just with like some brief tests. I'm gonna shit. Don't ever talk to me ever again. Oh, she's so cute. Oh my god, 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 oh my god
the shooting range has gotten to every streamer I've watched play so far. What you mean, like they spend like two hours straight on it or just like the cuteness of it or both or neither? Yes, yeah, perfect answer. I believe you. you miss. Fuck! That's not like you. Reload. You miss, that's not like you. I love that line. Weirdly encouraging and like also a weirdly kind of taunting way. It's like it's two in the middle. Makes me feel weird. I'm gonna cry, man. She's so cute. About to put on some snap cube to fall asleep, yo, but I guess live is even better. Hey, thanks for dropping by, honestly. Means a lot. Have a great time. Fuck! I'm mad! I hope no one has a great time, because I'm not having one. I don't care that something could happen to you. It should happen to me instead. I'm done, man. I can't. This 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 shooting range does something to me that I can't broadcast on Twitch. That was like something you'd see at the fair. It reminds me <gasps> of being a kid. Oh my God! Stop! Stop! You can't say that. I already love you. Oh my God! She's so good. She's so fucking adorable, man. Oh my god. Okay. We're gonna do two reds, one blue. We got so many. We got a surprising amount. We got a rare. JJ, rare. 40% off resources. Oh shit, we already have one of those. Fuck you. I don't want money. I want new stuff. <laughs> Watch Maximilian dude spend like two hours and 40 minutes straight trying to get all skulls on all levels and then afterward be like, wow, this chapter was long, almost four hours. <laughs> the shooting range is all consuming. <laughs> that's so funny. I, that's, I would fucking do that. I think that's the most valid thing I've ever heard in my life. That's fucking hilarious. Oh my God. <laughs> so funny. He did do that. And I think the world is better for it. It's all with bowgun. 20% bolts craft bonus frequency. Was that also a rare? I, I totally didn't even notice. Oh, hey. Let's see what this does. Come on. Common. Damn. 20% magnum ammo craft bonus frequency. Dude, I can't. I don't care about these. <laughs> I don't care about the ammo craft ones. Well, actually. Wait, maybe I do. I mean, they are good, but also, like, I want some more fucking, like, general use case ones. I feel like none of the ones I've gotten, I, like, want to replace with the ones I've been using for the entire game up to this point. But also, at least I can sell the one, uh, the one rare that we gotta double up. Fun for a reason, stranger. <laughs> Welcome. Ooh, oh, yeah, no, we noticed, um, we noticed that the, the charms... Oh, have the same models as the OG game. And like, I think the last time we like really focused on the first shooting range on stream. And like, I, I went crazy for it. I think that's so cool. That's like an absolutely perfect, perfect way to like continue to show reverence for the old game in a way that like nobody was even asking for. Okay, sorry, hold on. I just had to... I had to fucking gulp down some vitamin water here. Pleasure, dude. You only get a thousand pesetas for that? That doesn't seem like nearly enough for a rare duplicate. Maybe I'm insane, but I feel like that should be like 5k. Ruby's all rubbish. It makes no difference. The price, well, 
That's our choice to make. Well, True. I don't know what you're talking about. Travels. My chat thinks you're hot. Okay, see ya. Okay, let's get back to the game. Well, actually, first thing. Whoa. So the new stuff. We got Zola with Scythe. 20% submachine gun ammo craft bonus frequency. Jesus. 20% bolt craft bonus frequency. Or 20% magnum ammo craft bonus frequency. I think I'm sticking with handgun. Honestly. I think I'm sticking with the handgun bonus. I don't really know if I need to use any of these other ones right now. Why the fuck have I not been putting on my store ones when I go repair my knife? Am I crazy? Am I stupid? I keep forgetting. Fuck. <laughs> Damn it. We could go back to increase. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. You ever just get like, <laughs> you ever just get like a throat tickle? That like ruins your day. I don't know where that came from. That fucking snuck up on me. I was, <laughs> I didn't feel that one coming. Where did that come from? I don't know, man. Anyway. <laughs> I don't know if I want to increase Pesetas or gunpowder. We are doing pretty, pretty bad with ammo right now. Let's keep gunpowder. Gunpowder. Bam. Gunpowder for now. Dude, this stream is fucking cursed, man. This is nonsense. Okay. Let's keep going. Oh, fuck. All right. Can we get through this door? Probably not. Oh, shit. No kidding. Fucking fast travel already? No way, man. That's awesome. Audience chamber. Wait, what? This is gonna... Could take us all the way back here. Oh, is this the water? No. Oh, shit. This is like something out the chat chamber. <laughs> oh, God. I don't want to go there. That's where we are. Chat's in there. Let us out. Okay, fine. We'll go. You insist. There is a bonus treasure down there that you I want to grab. Get car sick or anything, do you? Actually, I used to not get car sick, but then I started, uh, then I stopped riding in passenger, passenger seats once I started driving hey, the military. Now I get car sick all the time. Anyway. Wow, that was a really long story, but if you cut it off in, like, a very specific kind of way on either end, it actually sounds like a very short story. But actually, there was a ton of context in the middle there that if you would listen to the full story, you would understand a little bit more. But if you have the short version, that actually just kind of sounded like you just said a very small amount of sentences in a row like that. <gasps> Jesus Christ, breathe, girl. <gasps> Sorry. Oh, I, I talk too much. It's, it's fine. I just don't want you to die. <laughs> Jesus. Where's the bonus treasure? Oh, it's right there. Whoa! Scary. <laughs> Crazy, right? Don't talk to me. Why? I don't know. So that'd be funny to say. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it leads back here. No kidding. Where is this? <clears throat> Ashley, look out! <laughs> Spin now. Elegant. Oh my god. And Jesus Christ. What the heck? What the heck is going on? Man, if I had saved my gems for like a little bit. Well, better late than yet. Well, better ever than ever. Well, better in than woo. woo. 
Bien. Better dinner than spaghetti. Oh, fuck. I gotta go back even more. Better pull the lever or whatever. Do you mean better Nate than lever? Seven dwarves. <laughs> yeah, no, the seven dwarves right at Disney World. You found Jet! Okay. Now that I know it's there, I can be a brave girl and go back and actually like, see what that's all about. Maybe. Here, let me. It's us. Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. You guys just scared me. Kind of freaked me out a little bit. It's fine. I just like wasn't expecting it. There's a hidden treasure in that room. And her name is Ashley Graham. <laughs> but I'm standing right here. Oh, who's to oh <laughs> I'm standing right here. Sorry. Okay. Well, what do I need? Okay, I have an idea. Let me just um We're just super excited to say hi to Leon. I hope you understand. Yeah, I do, but also he's like doing stuff right now. <clears throat> okay, let's try that again. Okay. okay. This way, Dogen. Okay. Do you guys know what I'm talking about with that? Hey, this is it. Yes, yes. I mean, I'm sure some of you do. You know about Psychonauts? Hold on. Psychonauts basic braining. Yeah, let's get the no commentary playthrough up here based. It's the Bobby Zilch section. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Watch those mines, kid, and then... Here. When you're dead! Hey, Dogen. What's wrong? I keep blowing up. Follow me. I'll help you through the mines. Okay. <laughs> there it is. Okay. Can Dogen just follow me? Okay. And he he says it over and over again. That's like his only um affirmative voice line in that section. I can't. I can't do it. I can't do it. Yes, you can, Dogen. Just follow me. Okay. I can't do it. Yes, you can, Dogen. Just follow me. Okay. Okay, I have a plan. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. What the hell are you doing? Don't huddle around like that! Don't do that! Don't do that! That freaks me the fuck out! Oh, it's this shit again. You have an ass that I'm ready to stab. Guys, 
you just try to fucking kidnap Ashley. I get you think she's cute. We all do, but like, don't be fucking weird about it. Maybe like be normal for two seconds and then maybe, I don't know. You like won't have a problem. Are you all right? Yeah, thanks. That actually wasn't so bad. I don't like the thing where you like get stunned for a moment because they're taking over your brain and your mind. It's annoying. Can I have another lamp? They already, I, I sold the one lamp already probably. Okay, we already went through here, but there's like a bonus treasure in here that I missed. This room is fucking creepy now. What happened to this room, dude? This is why you shouldn't uh, be addicted to your nostalgia glasses. Your nostal 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 nostalgia goggles. <clears throat> Guys, chat, I'm sorry for killing you. It's just you have to understand it's the... It's about how you approach a situation, you know? If you, if you come at me, like, you know, freezing me with, like, your silly mind powers and, like, attacking my, like, you know, my, es like, my escort girl that I'm trying to lead to safety. <laughs> that did not sound... You know, I forgot escorts are, like, a thing. Um, then, you know, but, like, if, if you know, if you keep bothering me like that, then maybe I'll just have to, you know, like, just, like, make you drop your lamp and, and shoot, shoot... I... I'm gonna stop talking. <laughs> I think maybe having any sort of Twitch clip, clippable moment where I am saying, where I am saying, chat, I am going to shoot you in any context whatsoever is probably a really bad idea. Sorry for those pauses there. I was just scratching my nose or something. <laughs> Hello, stranger. Again, you were heard all that like you knew that was going on. They were fucking hanging out with you, dude. Whatever. Ashley, let's get out of here. I do not think Coolsville sucks. You can't keep fucking trying to convince people that I think Coolsville sucks. Come on. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> Streams a nice atmosphere. I need to catch it more. <laughs> Even after I killed you. I think we made it. <laughs> Damn! I must be good at my job. <laughs> Seriously though, thank you. I appreciate it. Uh, gun rhymes with fun for a reason, stranger. <laughs> you have a diamond in here or something that I know it's it's here and I don't know how to get it. It's this thing. What the hell is this? You want me to put a Lego in there? Something's bound to catch your eye. Yeah, something did catch my eye. It's this shit. What's in there? A diamond? A ruby? Ashley, what are you doing? Exercising. Okay. Uh, emerald? Whatever. I'll figure it out. Where's the blue? Hiya! Here it is over here. Is there one like way up there or something? Or is that underground? That's upstairs. Where is that? That's like on the chandelier. Uh, where? 
Where the fuck is that? It's like right here. Oh, there it is. Wait. There it is. Ha ha ha. I see you. You blend you blend in pretty well, dude. <clears throat> okay. Pretty cool, huh? Done that like eight times. Even more. It's because I'm so good at it. It's not about novelty, it's about proficiency. You know the uh the, the the real people we should admire aren't aren't the ones who, you know, write the first line of code. It's the what? The real people we need to admire are the everyday guys, the ones all every day on the front lines of life. Plumbers, firemen. They're doing the real work. Fucking sit down first. I'm sweating so. <laughs> you okay? I'm I'm sorry. I'm having a lot of anxiety right now. It's really starting to hit me this situation where I'm kind of kind of keeping it together for your sake, but um, you know, when I was alone, I had some time to think, and uh, wow, this fucking sucks. No, you don't say. No, I did say it. You don't know that saying? What about say you don't say? I don't know the saying. What's this with you and saying, Ashley? Why not say it and not spray it? What the hell? I thought you. I thought that was like a, I thought that was an enemy. I was like, they're just sitting there yelling at us. <laughs> Wait, did I say yelling? <laughs> no, they're not yelling. No, they're not yelling at us. I thought, I thought it was just in there, like grinning at us. <laughs> Guys, I, I wasn't hearing yelling, I promise. I'm not, no, I was. <laughs> I wasn't hearing yelling that wasn't there, I assure you. <laughs> Fucking nightmare. Nightmare. <laughs> Die. <laughs> Wario! I got him! <laughs> I'm just having echoes of Wario throughout my brain. I mean, understandable if that were the case. But it's not, it's not anything, I promise. Hey, Ashley, grab this one. You can do it. I know it. You're tall. I'm tall. We're tall. We're together. We're even taller than before if we were on our own. But if we're together, then we're even taller. <sighs> she gets the fuck out of here. You can't break glass. Immersion busted right open. Wait. Okay. One sec. Where's the secret? There's another secret blue one over there. It's either in here or it's like around this way. Get out of the stop. Oh, there it is. I hope you know that any mention of Wario is going to poison your trap for the rest of time. Wario has poisoned my chat for the rest of time, whether I elect to mention him or not. The stream hadn't even started yet, and the, the chat was a cacophony of people yelling, Wario, I gotta win, in the pre-stream. I didn't even jump on mic yet. I hadn't even popped on and Philip DeFranco style jumped into it yet. And people were already, Wario! I'm gonna win! Oh, we have a red herb. Yummy, 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 delicious. Delicioso. I gotta win! Yeah, not that I'm complaining, by the way. I think it's perfect. Wouldn't have it any other way. Like I said, it's literally been like an echo in my brain. For days now. Um, I was looking through blouses. Um, or is it Bleece? And then I was saying Wario. I gotta win to myself. Oh shit, you look like the mask. Uh-oh. Oh yeah, it's this again. Oh, I loved this. We're sandwiched, all right. Yo, does that mean we're a Leon and Ashley sandwich? Resident Evil jokes confirmed. They have them. Hot, hot, yeah, we got it. Hot, hot, yeah. Ashley, you need to learn how to like walk two or three steps. 
depending on how far you want to go. It's really simple principle. Perhaps we can teach you after we get out of here. Can you, like, can you come this way, please? Ow! Not with the wide berth on your stupid sweeping attack. Dude, come on, Ashley. Not cool. Okay, fine, dumbass. Ashley, come this way. Piece of shit. <laughs> God damn it, now is not the time to reload. Just will the guns into your bullet. That'll work, right? Just as well, probably. Get up, get up, get What are you doing? Jesus Christ! He was special! I don't know if he deserves to die. He's special. God ordained him with the abilities that we can never be trusted with. And yet, much like God himself, he had to die for the safety of humankind. Go, 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 go this way. Run. This direction! There's a direction you should be going, and this is the direction you should be knowing. Get up the ladder. <laughs> Fuck! The other day, um, I explained to my friend Bryce, uh, the concept of um, the, the Catholic Godhead Trinity in terms of Avatar The Last Airbender. <laughs> Can you leave Ashley alone? She's with me. <laughs> go on um uh, well okay and to be fair i don't actually know fully if this is like correct or not but the way i understood it see i was raised in a, in a denomination that was like oh you know god and jesus are the same person right um and i don't i don't know exactly how much the difference actually holds up in in in, in other denominations of christianity but the way I explained it was like, oh, you can sort of uh, picture it in the same way you would <laughs> Avatar Aang versus his past lives and also the Avatar state being, <laughs> being similar to the god. I, and now I'm realizing explaining this now, I'm like, wait a minute. That's just like a whole, like, that's probably based off of like other like real world religious systems that I probably shouldn't equate to Christianity. By the way, it was a joke explanation. I wasn't actually like fucking evangelizing to my friend. We were just, we were just shooting the shit. I don't even remember how the conversation came up. Avatar is heavily Buddhist. Yeah, I figured, I, I do remember it being very, uh, very heavily based in Buddhism. Anyway, what I don't even know why why I thought of that. I think I said like some kind of Oh, I said like a thing about like I said like much like much like God he had to die for humanity. And then I was like, wait, that was Jesus. And then I was like, well, to some they are one and the same. And then I was then that just led me down a hole. That's very not right, I think, but also the funniest explanation, so it should be spread. Yeah, that's probably how we should do it. We spread ideas based on what's funny and not what's uh, accurate. I think that'll lead to like a really good future for society as a whole. Oh man. 
if any part of this conversation was needlessly disrespectful i'm so sorry <laughs> Genuinely, I am just really, I was really stressed out. I needed something to take my mind off of the fact that the big uh, worms were about to kill me and my girlfriend. <laughs> A big chest. Okay, so let me, hold on, let me re-assess my situation here. There's a, there's a blue medallion somewhere and it's hiding from me. There's a blue in this room, exactly, right. That's what I was thinking. I can sense it with my blue sensors. Where? Otherwise known as my eyes, my fucking... The cones in my eyes that allow me to see color. I realize we actually literally have <laughs> blue sensors <laughs> in our eyeballs. Fuck. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> so that's, wait, so that's four out of six. Wait, there's two more? Oh, I see. There's like a whole other room here. Okay, Jesus. It's like, I feel like, I feel like the encounter hasn't even stopped yet, even though like nobody's fighting me right now. That was, that was just a lot to take in. I was trying to, I was trying to fucking have a, I don't know why I decided it would be a good idea to try and multitask even a casual discussion about religion and the Godhead Trinity while I'm fighting zombies in an enclosed space. What is wrong with me today? I had I just have bad ideas all day. It's probably because like the worst idea I've had in a long time, that being the subspace emissary dub, actually had like some great fucking <laughs> return for me. <laughs> return on investment in chasing the bad idea. So now I like trust myself too much. I need I need a bad idea of mine to go like really, really poorly. Does someone want to start an argument on Twitter? Here, you know what I you know what I should do? I should play another persona game and then start tweeting about it. That'll do it. Yeah, I think that'll that'll hit nice. That'll take me down a peg. <laughs> Go ahead. There's two. Stop that! You're not allowed to come this way. Sorry. I decreed. Just let me go past. He's so polite. Okay, which way? Obtained goat head. So that's where we need to go. Whoa. Go! That was uh, Mr. Aziz from Spider Man 2. What was his name, right? Mr. Aziz? The guy went, Go! Man, I don't know if this this uh okay? this edit yeah, is gonna be a sure. dream or a nightmare for Ellie. Ellie, let me know when you get to this part. <laughs> Man, hey, but does it sit? Oh, ha, ha. And there's a symbol on the wall. You know, you should stop doing that or people are going to mod it out. Oh shit, a blue! Rats have infested- <laughs> You mean breathing? <laughs> Rats have infested a section of the castle and are gnawing away at all the precious books, but those heretics couldn't care less. Please, someone get rid of these vermin before it's too late. Exterminate all the- Oh, we gotta kill more rats. Hell yes. I mean, oh no. In the library? The library? Where's the library? 
Is that this way? Oh, it must be. It must be. Spend the day with Greg. And Steve. And Stu. And Mark. And Layton. And Chad. Statue of some snakes. That trick sound was uh, the, the special trick of recognizing animal. What the fuck? Of all the little crevices and holes I can shoot through. Huh. The dining hall. Order. It's here? No thanks. He can sit down? No fucking way. No, 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 no. No, you stop that right now. It's too good. Wait a second. Hold on. I can already tell I'm gonna fucking love this. One sec. Hello? You okay? Are there any other openings I'm missing? Whoa, hold on. Oh, hold on. Aha! Hey, that's a really good place to hide it. You do a lot of missions like this? Well, yeah, but I'm not used to having such good company. Oh! Is that a compliment? <clears throat> Take it however you want. It's it literally is a compliment. He called you good company. <sighs> that's so fucking cute, man. I see. I see what's going on here. Hmm. So the lady needs to sit somewhere, and the big boy needs to sit somewhere else. Why did you say it like that? Okay, let's figure out where the lady needs to sit. Napkin. Spoon, fork on the diamond, napkin on the left side of the plate. Then two knives on the right side of the plate, and a glass of water, please, with a small plate on the upper left. What's that? It's a mnemonic device. Do you remember it? Yeah. There's two plates, and if you have one, then if you have another, and it's gonna be fun. It's like not at all what you said. Fork and a knife on fork and a spoon on the diamond plate, and then there's two knives on the other side of the plate. And then there's a diamond napkin on the one side and plate on the upper left of that. Was closer. If you wear a hat, then you're gay. <laughs> Do you like that one? Um, yeah, I, mean, I guess it was pretty funny. Shh. Could you imagine? I actually have no clue where I should. I feel like, I. well, I feel like the napkin shape is duping me out a little bit. Okay, there's no like diamond shaped napkins. I think I'm overthinking it. Hold on. So it's okay, yeah, fork and spoon, glass of water, plate, two knives. Fork, spoon, glass of water, plate, two knives. I do think this is the spot for Ashley. Have a seat. Okay. Have a seat. This is so cute. Big wine bottle and an empty glass, and also a plate of bread on Zeth. <laughs> Sorry, it's not where that is. Uh, and then there's two forks and a spoon, and three knives on the other side of it. Oh ho, they tried to trick me! It's this one. Nope. It's this one over here. Nope. It's totally not this one either. What the hell? Where is it? It's this one. Ding, ding. That's fucking adorable, man. Looks like we figured it out. On me. Got it. That was just really, really 
cute and fun. What the hell? I like that. Are you okay? The snake poisoned me. We gotta go. I'm allergic to snake venom. We gotta go. No kidding. Lion. Lion two. No, what? Oh, there's another door. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. You know, this, uh, this layout is very much reminding me of, um... This layout is reminding me of fucking... Raccoon City Police Department in Resident Evil 2 Remake. With, like, the library over here and the other door over here and there's, like, two levels. I wonder if that was intentional. There's some armor. Bet you could use it like a bulletproof vest. Stop copying me. A little old-fashioned for my taste. Mm, too bad. I think you'd look pretty dashing. <laughs> this is so cute. Sorry, I was about to intercut it with like a funny, mean bit. But what they actually do is really cute. I just really, I like how much they like each other and like are talking and like weirdly kind of having fun. <laughs> on this horrible death trap mission. What are you doing? Is that fun? Um, no. No, seriously, is it fun? Oh, uh, yeah. Cool. <laughs> Let's go! Hell yeah. Hey, 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 come get this one. <laughs> hey, go. It's all right. Okay. It's What's this? Nothing, it's just a- oh, wait. Oh, <laughs> there's a thing up there. Demon Souls. Oh, Demon Souls 2. Nice to meet you. Uh oh. It's a scary looking room. <laughs> Don't like that. Don't like that one bit. Uh-oh. Ooh, Jesus. Kumi made the same Demon Souls joke? No way. No kidding. I make Demon Souls jokes like every time I see a suit of armor. After a certain amount of time has passed. Did he really make the exact same Demon Souls joke, like saying Demon Souls and Demon Souls 2 on these two specifically, or did he just see another suit of armor and say, "I'm like Jenny, I'm not, I'm being, I'm curious," because <laughs> the idea that that would be the exact same joke between the two of us is really funny and weird to me. I know that yeah, there's a blue here. I'm trying to figure out where it is. Is it? Is it on like the lower level? I'm starting to think it might be on the lower level. One sec. Oh, it's right there. I see. You're it's hot. over there. It was a different suit and somewhat different joke, but he absolutely called one of this armor suits Demon Souls. That makes more sense. Well, because one of the suits of armor looks straight up like the default Demon Souls armor. Like I've. It, you know what? And it, I think I specifically made the Demon Souls joke in Resident Evil Village, which makes me think I'm maybe making the same joke about this, the same asset. Because that asset was probably reused from Village to this point. 
I wonder if I went back and like checked the old series okay, if that would careful. hold up. Yeah, I, th I think that's straight up what's happening because that that specific suit of armor really does look exactly like the Demon Souls default armor, like on the cover. And since this game does reuse a ton of RE Village assets, I'm thinking that's the case. Fuck. Uh-oh, I have so many green herbs. We'll do it that way. Easy. I got the I got the new case and everything and it's already wow it is completely full it's not even almost full it is completely full to the brim so I have so much gunpowder I think I should switch it out for the uh, pesetas case soon I think well, hold on how am I doing on ammo oh my god I was about to make handgun ammo I think. Oh, you know what? We'll, we'll free up some space when I reload these weapons, yeah. Okay, I still need rifle ammo. Can I make rifle ammo? I can. Perfect. Beautiful. Now I can make something else, too. Keep thinking those resources are the worst blunts on Earth. Leon Kennedy. World's worst joint known to mankind. Asked to leave. I think I, I, I want more shotgun shells, I think. <laughs> He's a cop, so it makes sense. No! The cop and him died. Remember? How, how soon we forget? Shit. Okay. Perfect. Well. Oh, I remember this room. Oh, okay. I remember this room. Oh, god damn it. Fuck. Okay. Well. You gotta just fucking wing it, I guess. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Hi, Demon Souls. On, it's so good to see you. Whoa. Go, go, go. Get him. His, his helmet as a gift for me. It stayed in the air, aloft and free. And filling my life with majesty. <laughs> Suplex the armor, you got it. Damn it, it didn't do it. <laughs> I tried. Try again? Oh, it's, it straight up just won't do it. It doesn't want me to suplex. I love how their helmets stay aloft. That's so fun for me and my heart and soul. Hey! Ashley! That's badass! No kidding. Oh, 
Oh, she's so cool. Ashley, it's okay. Just stay safe. No, what the fuck? She's helping. Dude, let her do it. She's doing awesome right now. We're like destroying them. It's like not even a thing. Okay, I'm gonna stop using handgun ammo. Hold on. Go to hell, you. Oh my god, that actually freed them. Here goes my knife. What the hell? That's not what I wanted to do. I accidentally switched. Okay. Oh, you're the wrong way. I shouldn't be so judgmental. Maybe he's the right way for someone, you know? And that's what's important. Find someone who appreciates you for the way that you are and not this supposed right way that nobody can really achieve. Oh, now I can do this though. Hey, are you okay? Yeah. Nighty night, nights. Come on down. Cute! Oh my god! <laughs> I'm sorry! She said, she, she said skills with a Z! Oh my god. No, thanks for your help. I really did the trick. <laughs> this is like 2000 fucking four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty, forty, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty, 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 it's 2004? Okay, cool. We got everything? Leave me alone. Oh, two demon souls. You don't think they're gonna move, do you? And? That's demon souls you're talking about. He's my friend. A cubic de- uh, I've received a cubic device. Perhaps if I hook it up to some redstone in my survival safe file, I could possibly- I could maybe, um, I could maybe make it an automatic cow feeding contraption and even, uh, possibly, um, po my diamonds automatically with TNT and redstone and my cubes. You are not blended into the environment in a way that makes me confident you are not going to start moving the moment I start trying to open that door. Look at that. He's literally, he's like, he's, he's like hand drawn when the rest of this background is, is, um, is like a matte painting. This guy is fucking cell shaded. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like he's, yeah, he's standing like an old, like Hanna-Barbera cartoon. Watch this. Oh. Really? Nothing? Oh. Weird. I got pr I pranked myself, basically. Anyway. <laughs> this is not there's not something. I can tell by the look on your face. Leave me alone! What the fuck is that about? 
What are you doing, mate? What? You're not going to talk to me? What the hell is going on? What? Hello? <laughs> Leon? Are you for real? That's my stuff. You can't have my stuff if you don't talk to me. You can't have, you're not allowed to pick up that butterfly lamp if you don't talk to me. Leon. Uh, it's... Is this something so I said? Done and dusty, eh? Is this something I did? It... What? Oh, Hello? You took care of a request. Went th well, you we went done. to the wrong door. <laughs> That's funny, like a sitcom. Like a cartoon, mate! You... Walked in the closet, walked out thinking it was the outside door, but you walk out, and you say, nope, that was the closet, wrong door, and then you... Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm staying not okay. This way. He's just okay. weird. Isn't that a joke in Gravity Falls? Yeah, no, it's literally... Suze is like... Dude, wouldn't it be so funny if he walked... If it turned out that he just walked into the closet and he walked out and had to walk through the other door. And then he, he goes and opens like the real door. Oh, nope. Darn. <laughs> that show is a fucking genius. That show is fucking genius. Your Sue's voice is great. Thank you. I've practiced many, many times. Basically, like, uh, like I can, I cover... The larger portion of Alex Hirsch based voices in that show with uh, my Gravity Falls impressions. Um, like obviously, my biggest claim to fame is Bill Cipher. <laughs> um, that one sort of that one sort of helped me pick up momentum to like do this whole streaming thing that I'm doing now. Uh, let me like comic dubs and shit that people enjoyed. Oh, uh, but then of course also, dude, I have- I have Zeus just in my back pocket. Um... And then more obviously is Grunkle Stan, of course, I do this one quite a bit. Uh, here and there, I have- I have a lot of fun! Um... But then there's also Old Man McGucket! Who's an old favorite, but I don't get to do him very often because he's crazy! Anyway. Can you do Tad Strange? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Hang on. This is my Leon voice. I remember talking about uh, Alex actually responding to the impressions. Yeah, that was hey, that was fun. It? That was fun. It was like Yeah, well I did like um He had made a tweet. That was like, if you're gonna read my uh, tweets in Gravity Falls impressions, or if you're gonna, if you're gonna read my tweets, read them with the, with these character job. voices from Gravity <laughs> Falls. And then it was like, he was like, he was like, oh, Seuss is like my insomnia. No, no, he said he's like McGucket is my insomnia tweets. He said my political tweets should be read like Bill Cipher. Um, and then he was like, any, like, any selling merch or whatever should be read as Grunkle Stan. And so then what I did was I actually, like, made a, a dub of, like, a bunch of just his, like, various tweets that I went and, like, looked around for. And, like, all of them, like, matched up with those character matchings. God damn it. <laughs> I did that on accident. Whatever. Um, and so, like, I found, like, a political tweet and I read it as Bill Cipher. And then I, uh, I found like a, like a merch plug tweet, read that as Grunkle Stan. And then, um, and the, the funny thing is that he saw it and he was like, Hey, this is cool. And I was like, Hey, awesome. And then I think later, like, I don't know if he like did like a scrub of his account or whatever, but the, the tweet got deleted and I was like, ah, you know, whatever. And then eventually it like kind of resurfaced, like the video started kind of going around again and he saw it again. And responded again 
I was like, oh, I can't believe I missed this. It was so cool. And I was just like, the funny thing is that you didn't miss it the first time. I think you just forgot. <laughs> I was just like, I get it. I mean, I do the same shit all the time. I just thought, I thought that was cute. I was, <laughs> it was, it was funny. Yeah, no, it was, it was cool that he saw it though, honestly. That was like, that was well after I was like doing those impressions as like my, con hey, ooh, uh oh. Those aren't stairs, those are Ganados. Oh, God damn it. Oh, it's this. Run. Now. Oh, man. Holy fuck. Oh, that's so cool. <gasps> wait, is this? Oh my god, wait, 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 wait. Oh my god, wait. Is this it? Oh, holy shit. Oh, is this it? Oh, come on. I won't here run. we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. I won't run. Wait, oh my god. Run. Come on. Let's fucking go! Yes! Oh my god. Hell yeah. Oh, I was waiting for it. I'm so glad we're here. Oh, amazing. Oh, I was so happy. I need to find a light. Okay. Let's fucking do this. Shine forward. No kidding. Sparkle on. It's Wednesday. Remember to shine forward. Whoa, weird. What's the... What kind of a difference does that make overall? Am I looking? Okay, so weird. Okay, you can see a little more. So I wonder if this is more like combat use case than it is like navigation because it doesn't make that much of a difference in terms of actual like level visibility. Yeah, a little bit weird, but Buffalo. I gotta do it. Sorry. Every every time every time I start controlling a character that can aim uh anything, I have to do the button spam. <laughs> Broccoli. Broccoli! <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ! Don't scare me like that. Yeah, you and I are on the same page. He said buffalo reminded me of it. Oh, that makes sense. Broccoli! You're the guy I saw earlier. Do you have any secrets? No? Okay. I'm sure nothing will happen. Is that a clock? Sorry, I just... I'm not kidding. My eyes just started glazing over. I started just like fucking. I was getting so, like actually got so. I like a minor out of body experience with the um with the clock spinning there. That's okay. <laughs> we don't have to talk about it. Wait, in mausoleum. More like mausoleum. I. The resting forebears answer to the chosen time. It is the Lord's blessing you seek. Have courage and fear no darkness. <laughs> Real time hypnosis. <laughs> Hypnotized yourself. To what end? That'd be interesting to. <laughs> I wouldn't. Oh, fuck! She's gone! <laughs> Alright, well. You know what I have to do.
<laughs> Thank you for enjoying my shanty moment. I love that this, like... The... They kind of slightly recontextualize this part of the game with the whole, like, I won't run motif. That is so cool. To be fair, I don't actually entirely remember how much, like, character work went into Ashley before this part of the game in the original. But from what I remember, this was kind of just, like, a cool thing that you got to do. But, like, having, like, a kind of cool, like, emotional hook to it in that way... That's awesome. It's locked. it's locked. That's so cool. Genuinely, like, this is... This is how you fucking do the impossible and, like, actually improve on elements of the original game. I think, obviously, there is still a place for the original game, and I think most people I would recommend to play the original first before playing this one. But, like... I don't know. That's just, I mean, that's just, I think that's a lot of that is just because one, this game is so reverent for the original, but also I think going the other way around doesn't give you enough of a sense of how groundbreaking the original was, but it also doesn't give you as much of a sense as like, it doesn't give you as much of a sense of like how much of an improvement the experience of this one is in certain ways. The lamp has a seat that we'll use. I only watched your playthrough of the OG RE4 about this and I'm finding it an absolute blast personally. Yeah, well, you, you had like at least an emulated experience of the original game. I'm talking like people who play this one without even knowing anything about the it first like one. Like you saw the game still, even if you didn't play it yourself, you saw my experience with it and got all the meta commentary both for me and from chat about like you know the history of everything and all that shit like you you basically got the experience of the original game i would say in a way that would allow you to appreciate this one to the level that i'm talking about here not to say you can't appreciate one without the other by the way i really don't mean that so definitively i just mean like i think I think playing the original first and then playing this one is the most enriching version of that pipeline. Well, because I mean, that's just how the games were developed. Like that is the, that's the context the whole thing exists within. Is all the hate on Last of Us Part 2 purely sexism and homophobia? <laughs> Are there a few genuine complaints about Game Player Story? I'm sorry, I'm not laughing at you. It was just, um, I want to say let's not talk about Last of Us Part 2 on the <laughs> Resident Evil 4 stream. I'll say this much. A large part of it is that, but it's not solely that. There, there, well, I don't know. Okay, maybe I shouldn't say large. I actually don't know the ratio either which way. That is definitely a part of it. There is a lot of, um... There are a lot of valid criticisms for that game. I have a few of my own. But anyway, I'll leave it at that. I really don't, I don't want chat to talk about it, please. <laughs> it's like completely off topic. <laughs> Bunch of keys. 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 And a bunch of them. No kidding. Boo boo keys. Oh, right. We're going to come back through here with Leon, probably. If I had to guess, that's why that's there. Either that, or we'll find another little cube of our own. That's the worst sound I think anyone's ever invented. Stop that right the fuck now! You stop that right now. You stop that right the fuck now. <gasps> no kidding! Hmm. Don't fucking like that at all. You stop. You stop. 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 I actually just 
jumped so fucking bad. You have no goddamn idea. I said I told these motherfuckers at Capcom I didn't want to play statues ever again. What are you doing to me? <laughs> they heard you and they did it again. I gotta get that treasure up there. We're just gonna go, honestly. It's not that bad. It's not that bad, bro. I'm just lazy. <laughs> Where am I going? That's my name. Which one? Huh? What? Hey, it fucking pisses me off that this is just introduced to me, the fact that I have to select which proper key to use in that door that leads me out of the danger room where the statues are, are chasing me. Cool. Awesome. <laughs> Why is Ashley 20? It's a really good question. button. I hate elevators. No, we're going up. Stop. I hate this. I hate this. I hate this. I hate this. I fucking hate this. I despise this so, so much. excited to play as Ashley. And now I'm scared. <laughs> Who knew? Oh, you played Shadows of Rose? Yeah, it's on Snapcube too. Go check it out. Oh. Leon? Cutscene, save uh, me. Are you okay? Hang on. I'll figure something out. No, but I need this. No, I need this. Hi, sorry. Worst idea you've ever had. I need this lantern. Don't tell me I have to put the lantern in there. I don't like that idea. I don't think that's true. The insignia! The key to getting out of this confounded place is the Salazar family insignia. To find it, I must venture into the where that cursed armor awaits. The underground mausoleum. Oh, merciful lord, an actual righteous justice upon the wicked usurper, the maniacal monster, Ramon Salazar. And may your blessed blue light protect your forever faithful servant. Clive? <laughs> no, it's... <laughs> I gotta save, man. Oh, I don't have to. I don't have to put my lan lantern in the thing. I, I'm realizing I just need like a crest or something, right? Yeah. Can I stick my keys in there? <laughs> just try to mash them in like a like a round peg in a square hole. Just be like, get in here, please. Whoa! Hello, bird lock. Thank you. Thanks, man. That's it. That's it. I'm not a brave girl anymore. I gotta put on my brave girl glasses. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. That'll do it. 
that. <laughs> can I can I be honest? Oh, it's right. It's because it's in Spanish. I was gonna say that shit does not say clock. That says reloy. Oh, 11.04, 11.04 cock. Got it. His ass is not saying clock. I don't like that. Is this gonna be like another door that I have to like... I fucking can't stand this, man. I can't stand it. This is what's known as an anti-zoomer puzzle. That's so funny. You're right. You're not even wrong. Four. But I'm technically a zoomer, and yet... Yes. Maybe I'm just the smartest one. Those rattling sounds are gonna give me a panic attack. This game rules. This is so good. It's actually fine. He's actually just stupid. Watch. He like stops moving. It wasn't slow at all, girl. You started running. Here comes another one. What are we doing here? Oh shit! Don't look back! Don't look back! Oh, eleven oh four, same one. I sure fucking hope so. There we go. You fucking stop, man. That's just not right. Whoa! Robbie dude coming in with 102 viewer raid. Hi, Robbie! Stop embarrassing me. Sorry for being a yawny little bunny. Robbie, were you a yawny little bunny today? It sounds like someone was a yawny little bunny. I don't know. I mean, your chat's saying it. Hey guys, we're playing the scariest part of Resident Evil 4. And it's actually not that bad. I'm actually just like such a big brave girl, so like it's not even a problem. See, I'm wearing my brave girl glasses. Specifically put on to help me be brave. Hey, isn't that fun? That's funny because she had a suit of armor in the original game, I think. It's okay, Robbie, this is a safe space. No, we can yeah, we can be we can be brave girls and what was it? Bunnies? Sleepy bunnies. Yawny bunny? I don't I fucking know anymore. Didn't I just say I was done? That's funny. Yawny little bunny. Got it. Hey guys, where'd that come from? <laughs> okay, now, now that the bit's over, now that the joke's done, what started that? I need to know. <laughs> Get me out of here. <laughs> I'm sorry, Robbie. Spoken. Robbie said that himself. There's a clip. Robbie. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to say. You got some damning evidence you maybe got to refute here. I don't know, man. Let's let's find out. Ooh, sorry I'm so yawny today, chat room. Sorry I'm a yawny little bunny. <laughs> And I mean, there it is, folks. <laughs> now, let's, let's. What was the aftermath? You can see his soul die. Yeah. Hey, how about like let's let's pinpoint the exact moment. <laughs> Let's pinpoint the exact moment they regret every word they've ever said. Yawny today, chat room. Sorry, yawny little bunny. 
There it is. <laughs> Which is insane. They were <laughs> hey, listen, you know what? At least it's not live stream fails. <laughs> so, one of the most recent chat messages Dick is a name. <laughs> I'm sorry, I gotta see the whole thing here. Oh no. Hey, you went down for so long, buddy. <laughs> so sorry. Alfred was there. <laughs> oh my God! Wait. So many people were there. Oh no. <laughs> Nifty Twilight Kelly. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm gonna, uh, listen. I'm gonna stop there. I understand. I get it. I understand. I understand. You know what? I'm officially I'm <laughs> from this point. I'm on. I'm on, I'm on Robbie Defense Squad. <laughs> I'm on. I'm on Teen Rob. Uh, teen. <laughs> teen Robbie. Whoa. Weird. Okay, a little bit weird, but... <laughs> I'm fucking losing my mind, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Hey guys, remember horse ebooks? Yeah, the stream is insane. Yeah, we've had we've had a, we've had an adventurous. Thank you for bringing even more just like fully fucking cursed awful energy to the stream tonight, everybody. No, seriously though, thank you, Robbie. Thank you for the raid. Um, I'm so, I'm sorry about your bunny mishap. What am I doing, man? I'm pulling this bell. Oh, it's one. Jesus Christ! Stop! Don't do that. That's really fucking mean. This sucks. You're absolutely right, girl. Okay. <laughs> quit! 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 Stop! Don't fucking do that. This is this is the meanest game anyone's ever created. I think. Oh no, she's so scared. But like, actually, not in like a stupid, annoying streamer way, like me. There we go, 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 there we go. These two are gonna move, aren't they? No, they're not. I'm so, I'm, listen, I, I thought I had these games down to a T. <laughs> Sorry, the idea of that one, that I, the big golden one that I just saw moving made me want to die. <laughs> like I was about, I would, I would have rather deleted the game than <laughs> to have seen that one move right in front of me. I'm sorry. That was real. That came from like a fucking visceral place in my heart. Oh, I see. Oh, this uh, this one's actually cool. I like this. Hold on. One sec here. I literally jump scare. No, I'm not like not even fucking joking. My imagination as to what I thought that statue was going to look like when it moved right in front of me as I was running towards it and running away from all the other ones. That is what jump scared me. Nothing moved. Like, I, that was straight up, I was scared of my own imagination. Y'all gotta fucking quit making these noises. Here we go. Yep, here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, buckaroo. It's gonna move now, isn't it? 
I'm so mad. I'm so fucking mad. What the hell is going on? Why are these frozen? <gasps> what are you? Be good nights and stay still. Be good still and stay nights. Oh, this sucks. Oh, oh, right. The blue flames in the hallway froze them. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Penny, Mr. Treasure. Oh, boo fucking who? I'm about to die. Sorry. I won't be as rich as I normally will be. I bought the deluxe edition, okay? I can miss one treasure. There's a million other treasures that you won't have, maybe, depending on which version of the game that you didn't, that you did or did not buy. This game stinks. Where, why did the map put me all the way up there? Where are we going? Holy shit. Okay. <laughs> Interesting result. You see, when Leon gets hit with a sword, he's fine. Ashley should get one grenade as a treat. Not even as a treat, as a fucking courtesy at this point. Oh my god! Stop running through the darkest hallway that anyone's ever invented! Turn the lights on! Who did this? Who made this one? Who made this one? Who made this fucking one? Who decided? Who? Get out of here! Did I go the wrong way? I think I went the wrong fucking way. I think I went the wrong way. Well. Time to die. <laughs> oh. Oh, they actually didn't come through. <laughs> Hello. Whee! Fuck me. Let's do it again. Oh my god. Holy shit. Alright, so we go this way. Just through the library, I guess? Where does this... Oh! Right. Okay, I see. That's my bad. I got really turned around. Someone needs to make these man-made horrors more comprehensible, man. Fuck. Hey, what the- hey, that worked the first time. That was weird. Like the AI is emergent or something. Mm, strange. Why is this- why is the- why are the loading screens- why are they glitching so much like that? Is that my mod or is that the game itself trying to- scare me or something? That's so unlike it. It's out of character for this game to try and scare the shit out of me. Why does she run with so much arm movement? Uh, probably because right now she's more concerned with, like, staying alive than, like, what, a, like, a Twitch chatter thinks about her arm movement. I don't know. Maybe if we, like, filmed you running from, like, horrible, awful living statues that can kill you with a single sword swing, you might not look the most, like, composed. part of the game. I don't know what this is. God forbid women do anything. God forbid women, like, be scared wrong. <laughs> I'm sorry, I keep running right into it. I should probably just, like, lead it down. <laughs> Shut up! Shut the fuck up! She looks fine. Her face doesn't look all that scared, actually. Oh, yeah, that's fine. Oh, it's 
the brave girl glasses, right? True. Hey. So, the brave girl glasses are. Oh, we can't change it right now. <laughs> no accessorizing, girl. You're about to die. But when I'm about to die is the best time to accessorize. And the ass is stay whoa during rear. Leon! <clears throat> Ashley, are you all right? Yeah. Give me a sec, I'll get you out. Oh, and she's good to go. No concerns, no worries. It's a dead guy. Oh, fuck. Hey! Try this! Can you make it down? I can catch you. Yeah, I think <clears throat> so. This foundation looks flaky. I don't know. Maybe he's got too too much coverage. Oh, god damn it. Uh oh. You just tried to kill her, man? She's having a rough day. Shit. Well. Damn. Who's to say if things will be okay? Holy fuck, that was so good. That was a really good segment of the game. I am stressed right out. <gasps> sorry, 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 sorry. What's become of the amber? Sorry, nothing yet. <laughs> she said sorry. It's, listen, it's been a little bit. It's been a little bit, okay? It's been a long day. I'm really savoring the things in life that I appreciate. I'll just leave it at that. But my little helper is creating quite the commotion. Scary ass! Stop! Shut up! As long as you can keep your dog banned, banned, under banned. He's a good boy. Predictable. Fine. Keep your mutt. But don't come crying to me if you get bit. Damn it. <laughs> it's not enough. Changed your mind yet? Ada? Oh, she's still around. I've got a tip for you. Seems like something big is about to go down in the throne room. Babysitting's tough, huh? Hey, Ada. <laughs> Ada! <sighs> I don't know how I feel about her voice. Same work. As ever. <laughs> That's okay, you know what? That's fine. She's allowed. So that's a request done and dusted, eh? Good stuff, mate. Just kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, oh man. I see you took care of a request. Well done. Voice work is iffy, but people were really, really mean to the poor actress over it. Yeah, that unfortunately doesn't fucking surprise me. When are they not just like so awfully abusive to dusty, actors and actresses <laughs> completely like unrelated to the quality of their voice work? <laughs> I knew I could count on you. Oh. I got something new for you. I'll take, I'll take, I'll take and fucking, I'll take fucking bad performances by happy people over like <laughs> good performances from abused people any day. <laughs> I'll leave it at that. I know, like super crazy, like 
I'm I'm really, you know, setting the world on fire with this take, but like I just think you should be nice to people. And if someone that like in your pocket doesn't your say life. the words in a way that makes you super happy, you probably like should just like play the video game and <laughs> like be a normal person about it. We've been saving that one. This is the this is the first right. I've heard about it, so I don't You've actually know how far it goes. I'm I'm getting time. intel from chat here, but um that like but you know, again, it's like it unfortunately doesn't surprise me, like, uh, um, with fun. that a response like that would even be possible. You could say this is like a, well, the fact that I believed it just says something about the state of our world kind of situation, but also, For a reason, I've seen the evidence that. firsthand that this shit is possible. Anyway, I just, I find that idea abhorrent. And I'm sick of it. Still think she feels like Ada even with a voice direction. Yeah, no, I mean like I I literally like just that one line, I was like, oh, I don't know how about I feel about that delivery. I don't know if it gets like better or worse later, but who cares? <laughs> the game is fucking great, whatever. Okay. Um Welcome. Oh shit, I got a lot of stuff to consider here. Ruby's all rubbish, it makes no difference. The price will Okay, so we can sell this. A deal it's great. Well so we have that right off the bat. <laughs> well then, what can I do you Actually like our voice work voice work a lot might be because I haven't played the OG. It's so not it's not like I'm like it's not even a huge again, I've heard like maybe one or two lines where I was like, Oh, I don't know how I feel about that. Um, but like even then, it's not a gigantic <laughs> leap in like performance quality resident evil games are like not <laughs> known for their <laughs> stellar voice work at least from like a from an art standpoint i mean in fact some would say the opposite the whole point is that they kind of yuck it up a little bit <laughs> they kind of go ham and we love it right like am i wrong yeah the the jill sandwich is a thing Um, the only thing that threw me off it was is that it wasn't the same VA as RE2. Yeah, I, I, I think I feel the same way. It definitely it feels more like a different character when you don't have that like voice parity between the two games. Personally, I hadn't actually played RE2 all the way through. Um, especially not Leon's. I think I've only played through Leon's story like one time, and that was when we did the Let's Play back in like fucking 2020. Or like I think maybe late 2019. I don't know. Um, <clears throat> but like I haven't played it in so long. I don't even really remember what she sounded like entirely. So I didn't notice it right away. But yeah. Um, okay. I am thinking it's getting pretty fucking late. So for my own sake and also for the sake of chat, I am going to stop here. Um, because I I think this is a good stopping point anyway. We're at chapter 10. So we're about at the halfway point of the game if not just over i believe so we still got a ways to go hopefully i i mean honestly one of the main reasons why we've been going so slowly through this game has been the internet issues that i've been running into there have been like two or three entire streams of this game that were supposed to go for like fucking four or five hours or like i was ready to have them be like long streams where i just like slurp this game up like a soup um, and they just got cut off, like, way, way sooner than I anticipated, um, or than I wanted, right? So, thankfully, this one was not one. We did have a couple hiccups here and there, but very, 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 very small ones. Um, <clears throat> mostly just frame drops, and then there was one that, like, almost cut out for, like, a couple people for a couple seconds. Thankfully, though, new modem so far, doing good. Um, then again, this could just be a fluke. Either way, we'll see. Um, I'm really crossing my fingers. It's overall a bit more stable with the new modem. I really, really hope so. I would love to not have to worry about this anymore. And just be able to make good content and move forward and do fun stuff whenever I want and not have to worry about if it's past midnight or in some cases past 
uh, 8 p.m. <laughs> um, anyway, but for now, I'm going to stop. So, yeah, uh, tomorrow... Oh, shit. Oh, God, tomorrow is fucking Sunny Sketchbook. Oh, God. Okay. I'm going to be real. Don't be surprised if I skip Sunday Sketchbook tomorrow. I'm sorry. Like, I really... I want to I wanna get back to doing it every Sunday. And I promise that's the intention. Um... It's been crazy and a lot of stuff has been thrown out of whack this past couple weeks. It's been weird getting things back on track. I think we're going to, again, I think late April, we're going to have a much better time getting the schedule going. Um, so I still might do it tomorrow. So I'm not even saying it's full on canceled, but if it doesn't happen, I'll let you know and just assume it's because I'm taking tomorrow to rest uh, because I don't know what we're doing Monday. I'm... If I don't do anything tomorrow, I might throw in a Last of Us Part 2 stream on Monday because I don't want to wait too long before the next one of those. But next thing, hopefully, assuming plans go well, on Tuesday, we will be streaming The Murder of Sonic the Hedgehog, which is the new Sonic April Fool's game that, that uh, the social media Sonic team just released. I'm going to gather some some friends from the real-time fan cast together, and we're going to... Um, we're going to stream that and do the voices and all that. And then Wednesday, I will not be streaming. Wednesday, I will be taking a break. Unless I elect to just do it, like, really, really, really late. So, yeah. Well, because, and specifically, reason why Wednesday is Mario movie premiere night. So, I'm going to go see that with some friends. We already have plans for that. Anyway. um, Hey, I'm going to raid Germa. Okay? Okay. And then I'm going to get the hell out of here. He's currently playing Breath of the Wild, so I'm going to send you all over there. Have a great time. Um, thank you all so much for watching the stream tonight. I hope you all had a good one. Um, please have a wonderful day or night, whatever it is where you are. What do we say? I don't know. Don't say sleepy little bunny. Just just say just be a good just be a good person. <laughs> just say say whatever you want, but don't don't be annoying. Okay. <laughs> not not that you're annoying by default. You know what I mean. Um have, have a wonderful night or day, whatever is where you are, everybody. Please take care. Um, and uh, just have a good one. So, yeah, I'll see y'all. Um, if not tomorrow, I'll see y'all on either Monday or Tuesday. Uh, we'll see. I know I know it's, like, really kind of scattershot right now. I'm sorry. I wish I could give you something more concrete as to immediate plans. After next week, it's going to be back to sort of business as usual, unless something else sudden comes up. But either way, I'll, I'll keep as transparent as possible with all y'all about that, of course, even if things get crazy with the schedule, I always try to at least keep you posted. So keep an eye out, all that good stuff. Thank you for all the support today on, on the dub and also this stream. <laughs> this was a great one. I had a great stream tonight and just a wonderful day in general with the release of that sub subspace dub. So yeah, thank you so much, everybody. Have a wonderful one. Goodbye for now. Bye, 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 bye. Good night. See ya. Woohoo! I'm saying goodbye to, uh, too many times. Oh, uh, fuck. Uh, shit. <laughs>